hello 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 welcome everyone welcome everyone to another nice long haul here across the pond let me give a couple shout outs here before we get started here let me just start from uh what's up kip what's up kip man welcome aboard kip nice having you as always thanks for joining you got a uh, fish on board what's up fish fish ike fish ike Welcome aboard, dear Fishank man. Thanks for joining us, man, as well. And I think we also have uh, Arkin. I think Arkin may be with us as well, too. Arkin, if you're there, man, welcome aboard. Nice having you. Hey, folks, listen, we have um, today, we, uh, we'll be flying from Toronto, Canada to Amsterdam. No, this flight's going to be six hours and 55 minutes, so... Start off, get your popcorn, kick your feet up, relax, get a drink, get dinner, get whatever you need, man. We've got a long haul ahead of us, man. And also, check it out, folks. I um, got a little bonus for everyone as well, too. Um, I went ahead and purchased the, um, the Fly Tempa Toronto Airport, yeah, which is the least edition here. Give me a little tour of this airport, folks. Definitely got to open this up for you as a bonus, man, for y'all. Well, right to see what it's like and on the flip side also purchased the fly tempa amsterdam airport too so a couple things here all right a couple things here to get started it's going to be a cold and dark start folks flying the dreamliner boeing 787 max 78 aka 787-10 oh man this thing's a beast klm y'all this is going to be a great 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 flight y'all we're going to be cruising at 33,000 feet as far as initial climb altitude, cruise altitude, and what have you. We're going to get up in the skies here and um, and uh, and really have a great time, y'all. Hey, listen, let's go ahead and um, get started. I want to at least merge nicely into our airport. And uh, we're, we're going to do a little, no, it's not even no rush action here. We've got a lot of time on hands on this one. So look, let's go ahead and get to our aircraft from this airport. This airport's pretty cool, y'all. That's a pay wear. No, price ain't bad. No. Uh, but I think they did a lot, a lot of good work on this airport here. Um, for uh, Fly Tampa. Fly Tampa, of course, y'all know, got a lot of, a lot of well-modeled airports that uh, they've launched. So I've, I've, I've captured a couple airports. This would be two that I got all at once, both Toronto and Amsterdam. Um, y'all, so what we're going to do... And we're gonna get on this flight here before we even get it loaded before we get started before we get the code and dark start so i can show y'all how to start this aircraft from the very beginning uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, get around the airport too so i can show you this airport um, for those who are interested in making this purchase for um fly tampa for fly tampa toronto and amsterdam hey what's up there arkin there you go there you go arkin welcome aboard there arkin for this ride that we're gonna have man across the pond there. Uh, a special quest there. So we're gonna go ahead and get this here rolling for you, Arkin, right? Let's make this happen, right? All right, so folks, here's our aircraft here. Oh, there she is. She's a beauty, huh? She is a beauty. She's a beauty, folks. Let's get on the outskirts. Let's get on the outskirts here. And let's get up and out. And let's uh, let's just look at this airport real quick. I wanna get y'all, let y'all see what this airport looks like. We got the Sheraton Hotel. Modeled into this um, fly tempo, right? She looks great, man. We got a lot of moving pieces here. We got the traffic. We got traffic out here as well too. Moving around here. We got the uh, I think it's cargo area. No, it's not cargo. Cargo is across the airport over there. This cargo. Also see some of the city back there in the background too, right? Nice, nice, nice modeling here. All right, and just let y'all get a little feel for what is what it's like, huh? What this purchase is like. We got a monorail. Looks like we got a monorail to and from the airport as well. This model. Sweet. Nice. Good job. Of course, I have submission. The Sheraton Hotel, which is attached to the the main terminal of the airport. Uh, there's that monorail. Ah, it's actually an active monorail. Cool. Look at it, man. I didn't realize it was active, too. It's actually an active monorail. Good, 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 good for the developers. Good job there. They did a great job on it. The developers did a great job on this one. All right, and they got a couple um, posters up here. What do you say? Do you hear? What does it say? 
Do you hear that? Air Canada? It's silence. It's called silence. <laughs> Alright, that's cool. Alright, we're going to leave that alone. Alright, we've got a tower. Let's see if the tower is modeled. Let's see if the tower is modeled here. What do we got in tower? Uh, nothing inside, inside the tower. That's okay. Alright, let's get back to our aircraft, y'all. Um, let's get the... Let's get this aircraft started up. Fueled up, loaded up. It's like a big, big terminal area right here, huh? We got some people walking around this area, huh? Oh, check it out. Well, this is cool. This airport is not bad, huh? Well modeled airport, huh? I think this might be the area where we should have actually been sitting at for the international. It's like a bigger area, of course, but that's okay. We're already at our gate, ready to roll. Yeah, this is a, a nice area here. Wow. Club Lounge, I'm sure, is over there, too. All right, let's get back to our airport. Aircraft, I meant. We are sitting right about in here. Uh, no, we're on the next leg right over here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Let's see this. All right, folks, we're going to be departing out of runway 23 on our departure here out of Toronto. All right, once we get the, our pushback to start, we'll go ahead and get a nice view of our taxi area as far as our, our route to um, uh, for our departure, all right? All right, folks, let's get on board. Let's get this aircraft started up. Uh, let's uh, put some juice in there. All right, turn the batteries on. Following the batteries, we're gonna go ahead and put our externals up. Get our externals up and go in there. Right. There, everything start lighting up on us. All right, come on, there you go, there you go. Everything's firing up nicely. Cool. Alright, uh, before we even do anything else, let's go ahead and um, turn on the IRS. Turn those on. Um, FD door power. And we're going to not really turn much else on right now. I'm just going to let everything just we'll put a logo light on. We'll even leave beacon off now. Alright, All right, so with the external power on, before we even put on their APU, let's go ahead and get our aircraft. Uh, program here. All right, so with that said, folks, just look at our airport here, Toronto. There she is. All right. All right. There she is. All right. We're gonna be departing via the Bird 07 departure. Okay. We're not gonna change it. Let's do an overlay on it. Okay. Here comes the overlay. Open the chart. There we go. That's our departure of uh, uh, Birdo departure. Coming out of Toronto, we're gonna be uh, like I mentioned, departing off of runway two three on our takeoff, and two three indicates that we see unless otherwise assigned by agency climb heading two three seven to one thousand one hundred feet. Climb right, turn heading two four five degrees, or as assigned by expected ra uh, radar vectors to Sevor. Sevor is gonna be our first waypoint, and we're gonna. Turn to, turn left to. Once we look, come up off that ground there. And what else we have here? Um, as assignment. Okay. Then proceed via via predicted, uh, depicted route. And <laughs> there we go. All right. So there we go, folks. That's going to be our departure coming out of um, Toronto. All right. All right. So let's uh. Let's go ahead and get our program here. All right, uh, let's see, first things first. All right, let's go to our index. Let's, I, let's do the ident here so we can get the uh, aircraft lined up as far as the uh, nav systems and all that. Let's see, C, airport C, YYR, YYZ for Toronto. Right. Gonna put our last position coordinates there and load that. There as well too. Okay, well that's already loaded. We're good on that. Cool. So that's already set. GPS is already set there. Let's clear that. Okay. And now let's uh, put in our. Let's see if it's gonna pull our route from um, from that sim or not. I mean from um, sim brief. Yeah, it didn't. That's all good. All right, just gonna type it in. All right, so let's see. Flight plan is ready to load or eraser. Oh really? It's there? It made it life easier for us. Let's hit load. Oh cool. Cool. I tested this out yesterday, y'all. It did not work. But it's working today, which is great. 
So it loaded from our flight plan that we have on SimBrief automatically. Execute. Sweet. That saved us some time right there, y'all. Cool. We don't have to go through the whole program piece here. All right, so let's um, um, let's go ahead and load this piece up into. Well, before we go here, let's go ahead and do our route before we go into the performance here. Uh, okay, let's see. Right, so we got that. Let's go to route and let's go for our departure here. So we got departure as mentioned, folks. Let's look at it again here. It's going to be the Virto Seven departure. Let's go ahead and find Virto 7 departure here. And there's a Virto 7 coming out of here. And we're going to transition um, out of um, this waypoint via. Let's see here. Let me see here. One second. Here. Okay, let me input the. Uh, one second. Let me bring y'all back over to our screen here. Put our departure back in there real quick. Wait one second. Here we go. Charts coming up. It's going to be via the Virto. Uh, it's going to be the SID. Via SID. There we go. And get our Virto back on there. Where's our Virto? There we go. There we go. Got a Virto back in there. Uh, not that Virto, but uh, this Virto. There we go. Cool. All right. All right, so we got a Virtle back in there. Excellent. All right, and there we go. We got her on the map nicely. Sweet. All right, so with that said, folks, let's go ahead and look at uh, what our transition is into our route. It's going to be Lorca. So let's put Lorca in there. There's Lorca. And we're going to be departing via runway, mm, what is it, 2-3 uh, today. Hey, what's up there, Mr. Cassiano? What's up, Mr. Cassiano? Welcome aboard there, man. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Runway 23, and we're set for our departure, y'all. Coming out of here. All right, so we're good on that. Looking at our legs, let's just make sure our initial legs are set. We'll work on our arrival later. Let's just at least get our departure set. Oh, yeah, we're, we're good, y'all. Look at that. It's already putting up those those coordinates and all that. All the way through, you see Elser, Mills, you see previous to, for that, it's going to be Orca, Advic, Mills. All right, let me double check that on our plan. We just collaborate that departure, you see Lorca, Imana, Advic, cool. And all that looks good. Elser, Elser, yeah, it's all there. All right, so let's go ahead and proceed forward. We'll worry about our arrival later, y'all. We won't take time. We don't use time right now for putting our arrival. We'll do that later, all right? All right, so let's put in our cruise altitude, which is 370. Uh, let's just have a great fun time. Ah, local time in Chicago. What's up, what's up, Alex? What's going on, man? What's up, man? Welcome, 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 welcome. Cross index. Cost index is what is our cost index, y'all? This cost index is 160. We're going to use for our flight today 160 as far as our cost index. 160. 160 is in there. Cool. Zero fuel weight. Uh, what's our zero fuel weight that we're going to kick off with? Zero fuel weight is 95,300 pounds. Good gracious. 95,000, 95, 95.3, 0 free weight there, doesn't like that, huh, <laughs> zero, three, uh, 0 free weight, I'm sorry, 3, no, it's, it's much more, 378,000, it knew that was wrong, it's 378,000, 378,000.4, part of 0 weight, Okay, it likes that one. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go five percent right there, as far as our reserve. And okay, that all looks good. That looks good. That looks good. Oh, that looks good. So we're gonna go ten on our flaps. Excellent. 
And as far as uh, what's the weather right now? We'll put our temperature in here as well too. Well, Toronto, it is. What is our weather, y'all? See if y'all ahead of me or not. See if you got your eight us up. Yeah, I'm gonna find it for y'all. Do this. See C Y Y Z. As far as our weather, for our eight us, it is showing we are at. Um, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Zero four degrees. Got it. Cool. Zero four degrees on the Celsius there. And all right, let's go ahead and put in our our center of gravity. Let's give us trim of 4.5. So there we go, center of gravity set. Now let's set our let's move our trim up now to get it in the green. And bingo, center of gravity's in the green. We're good there. Okay, next we can put our V speed set there. Of uh, 164. It's going to be, I see, rotate at 159. 164 is what we set that for. So let's go 164. We'll go 174 actually. Give it ten, 10 more knots. 174. Got 174. Cool. And what did I say our cruise altitude is 33,000. Let's set that 33,000. Okay, okay, okay. We're almost done, y'all. We're almost ready to go here. All right, so let's initiate a flight here. Let's see what the performance looks like as well. All right, so all oh, this looks good. Condition, what's the condition like outside, y'all? Is it, it's kind of, is it rainy or no? I don't know, it's just overcast. Uh, I'm not gonna go rainy on that. Just leave it alone. We'll consider that as condition as, I don't know, good. All right, um, winds. All right, winds is gonna. We got zero six knots of winds. All right, and and what is OAT again, y'all? I'm taking a blink here. Oh man, this is you find OAT, and oh man, why am I taking a blink here? You find OAT. What is that? Oh shoot, man. I don't know, man. You guys help me out, man. Define OAT for me. I totally forgot what that was, man. Shame on me. All right, um, flap configuration. We're gonna go ten. Um, all right, I think we're good on that. Nothing else is needed. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Oh, look at Nightbot. Nightbot looking out for me, telling y'all make sure y'all like and subscribe. Um, uh, let's see. So, Arkin, let's see what y'all talking about. Clinton, what's your dream airline to fly for? Mm, Emirates, man. I like, I like, I like United because I fly United a lot, man. But Emirates, man. Emirates, I, I don't know, man. Something about Emirates, dude. I think Emirates come with a big package, man. Emirates, Emirates is a, um, is a, uh, uh, this service, man, is phenomenal, man. Can't go wrong with Emirates, man. I don't know about OAT, y'all. What's OAT, man? Help me, y'all. Um, help me out, OAT. Let me see. Define. God, man, we gotta find a define um, aircraft. Aircraft, right? OAT. What does that mean? Outside air temperature. <laughs> I told you I was gonna feel silly afterwards, man. I did. Outside temperature. It feels what? Zero six. Oh, I got it wrong, y'all. That should be zero six here. And um, wait, 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 wait. Zero four. I'm sorry, zero four. Zero four. Zero four. All right, we're good. All right, we're good, y'all. See, I'm a little, I'm a couple steps ahead of y'all, man. <laughs> Sass is still much better, huh? Minus Sass, A three fifty. Outside temperature, right on, Alex. Alex, Alex, you get points on that one, Alex. Right on, man. Alex gets points on that one, y'all. I think he jumped there, jumped everybody on that one. Right on, Alex. Appreciate that, man. Do you like X Plane or Microsoft Sim? I I started off with X Plane, um, but I merged over to to uh, to uh, Microsoft, man. I've been with Microsoft ever since, man. I got hooked, man, and never went back. I think that kind of tells the story there, huh? Yeah, man. I think that tells the story right there, man. Right? Let's put RTO up. Um, let's just cross check everything here. We're gonna go ahead and request. We're gonna go the APU started up here and get things going here. Let's turn some things on here. Turn our pumps on. Turn our 
our packs on. Put our primaries up. Yeah, I can't wait to get this bird up in here, y'all. I'm like, like real excited here. All right, turn our seatbelts on. Turn our wing lights on. Turn our beacon on. Uh, okay, put a dome light up a little bit. All right. Um, uh, let's put our ele electric, electrical components, our hydraulics and all that stuff. And the demand for electricity on auto. Let's also go start on the APU. Get the APU started. And let's watch our APU come up, which should be on the screen here somewhere, huh? There's an APU at. Do we see our APU? Oh, I see it right there. I see the numbers going up right there. Cool. All right. uh, so, 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 R, can we say it is the best airplane game out there, out there, in my opinion? Man. Uh, I, you, you know you got my vote on that one, man. <laughs> you got my vote on that one, man. For sure. Oh, let's get um, let's get uh, um, ATC online with us, y'all. Let's uh, let's file our flight plan real quick here. Um, let's see, if, uh, let's see, we are KLM 1979, and we're flying the uh, Boeing or flying 787-10. Seven eight seven dash ten Dreamliner, got it. And let's go ahead and uh, file a flight plan. All right, so let's file a flight plan. It's coming up, so we can get uh, air traffic control in line with us. Let's see what we got here. All right. Nah, okay, let's update it. Okay, KLM. Yeah, we want we want to fly with air traffic control, right? Um, seven eight seven. Put seven eight cent. All right, go heavy on that. Um, what else we need to fill out here? Our cruise altitude. Let's see what our departure time is going to be. Our planned departure is going to be. We got our flight plan for that. Mm, what is going to What is going to give us here? Uh, fourteen thirty seven. Oh, fourteen thirty seven on that. Fourteen thirty seven. All right, one second, 1437. There we go, 1437. Um, our departure airport's gonna be CYYZ. Um, cruise out to gonna be 33 as far as our initial cruise. All right, airport arrival's gonna be Amsterdam, EHRM. The alternate airport we're gonna be landing at is going to be, I know we're moving right along, y'all, because we wanna get the bird up in the air, man. I'm trying to get it going here, so let's see. Our alternate airport's gonna be EHEH, -E -H, whatever that is. E H E H. Okay, and let's go again on that uh, 1437. Uh, 1437 again. Quick expedite way to put our flight plan in there. Submit it to air traffic control. All right, copy our flight plan. Place our flight plan there in our route, and let's hit submit. Bingo. We got it, y'all. We got it in there. We're good. All right, so no need to worry about that anymore. We got our flight plan loaded. And we have Toronto Tower online with us, folks. So we're going to tune in the air traffic control here. Uh, let's see what the um, recommended departure is going to be coming out of Toronto. Um, well, I'm giving you all the whole spiel today, huh? All right, so it's going to be altimeter 992997. Nine, nine, oh, did I put something wrong in? EHAM? What did I put in there? What did I put? Did I put something wrong? Hold on, let me double check that, man. Let me look at our plan real quick. Oh, shoot. Man, good catch, man. Good catch, dude. Right on, man. Right on, good catch. Oh man, I can't believe, it. look at that. Good, good catch here, E-H-A-M, that's right. Right on. Ooh, that was right on time. Glad I looked up and saw that, man. Uh, who, who said that to me there? Uh, Alex, man, appreciate that, Alex, man. Appreciate that, man. Okay, all right, so where are we at here? Um, so I think we're good to go. Um, air traffic control here. Let's see what they recommend as far as our departure. It's gonna be runway. Two, three, where we got that planned out already. Okay, simultaneous parallel ILS individual approaches are in progress as well, too. 
Um, so your primary approach is going to be runway 24, left, secondary approach is going to be 23, simultaneous approach, okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Departure runway 23, advance, you have information, hotel on board. Excellent. All right, let's go ahead and tune in to air traffic control here, y'all, so we get our clearance for our departure. All right, all right, all right. Um, and we're, let's see, forgive me, folks. Um, been a while since I flew this one, so we just put our frequency in here. Now let's just go right here and see if we can put our frequency here. Let me see. Can we put comms here? My comms don't go here. Hold on one second. I'm close. I'm close. I'm getting warm. Hold on. Let's see. Here we go. Got it. All right, comms right here. Let's go. Let's go. One two one one eight. One one eight point seven zero zero. All right. Oh no. We gotta. We gotta. We gotta speed up. We gotta speed up the music a little bit, y'all. I can't do that. All right, so let's transfer that out there for one one eight point seven. Uh, so we're on frequency now with the uh, Toronto as far as tower. Now let's go ahead and also get um, Toronto Center on standby, which is gonna be one two five one two five point seven seven five. Okay, cool. Got that on standby. You say you always got our back, man. What's up, Arkin? I hear you, man. Right on, dude. Say I'm always European and I fly <laughs> mostly Microsoft flights and Vassin. Right on, man. Gotta fly Vassin, man. Said love Denmark. Nice, beautiful country. Yeah, man. That place is beautiful, man. Uh, see you in landing in Copenhagen now. All right, folks. We are uh, we're on frequency here. Let's turn up our um, uh, turn our uh, squawk mode, Charlie, and let's uh. Let's let's chat with air traffic control real quick, man. Let's see if he um Let's get our clearance from him here. Hold on. Stand by folks. Uh, tower this KLM 1979 heavy request clearance to Amsterdam uh, Tower this is KLM 1979 radio check Okay, he's not transmitting there. Hmm. Wait okay, one second. Let me check uh, Toronto real quick, folks. He might be having some issues there. Wait one moment here. Let me uh, put us in Vassim as well. KLM 1979. 1979. Make sure we're showing up on this on the scope there. Yeah, so let's let's contact center, y'all. Let's see what's going on with the uh, tower here. Stand by. Let's let's connect the center and see. Hey, center. This is KLM 1979. Uh, radio contact with you. I want to make sure y'all able to hear me. Oh, I got nothing back. Oh, I got nothing back, y'all. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Let me give uh, one second here. I want to at least make sure these guys, if it's not me, if it's me, maybe it's me, but uh, I'm showing our radios up. Our radios up here. Center, this is KLM 1979 radio check. Oh. Alrighty then. Alright, folks, here's what we're gonna do here. We're gonna nicely disconnect from um, them real quick. Let's just go ahead and get, all, get a flight up on. Uh, let's get the flight out of here first, folks, and then we'll connect with them later, right? Let's get out of here. Alright, so we got our APU started up. Alright, let's go and request our push and start from um, GSX. 
I'm ready to get going, y'all. We'll, we'll connect with them later. All right. All right, GSX, come on, where you at? Come on, GSX. There we go. Let's get this. Let's get this out of here. GSX, let's go. Alright, uh, let's go. Request pushing. Push back and start there. Cool. Uh, ice, ice warning. Do you want to the ice? No, we don't want to do that. Due to icing conditions, please stand by for engine start until push completed and brake set. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Alright, we're good for now. We got, we got, um, fuel in the center pumps. So we're going to turn the center pumps on. Got a lot of fuel on board here. And, um, Emergency lights, uh, what's our emergency lights? Because emergency lights are up. Hello, Captain. We're ready for pushback. Uh, let's see, emergency lights, where's emergency lights here? No, no. It's up here somewhere. We'll go find that as we keep going. Let's get this bird pushed back for now. Ah, oh, I see emergency lights. There we go. I think this arm now. All right, emergency lights is armed. Cool. What else are we waiting here? All right, so engine shut up, fuel start, hydraulic hydraulic pressure. How's our hydraulics looking? We have hydraulics on. Once we get the engines turned up, it'll generate the pressure for the hydraulics. Once we get the engines going, all right? So we're all set there. All right. All right, there is that. So connecting us, get us connected here. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with comms, y'all. We're gonna we're, we'll get back to comms here a little later. Figure out what the dealy is. All right, so what do you have here? Um, select pushback option direction. Wait, 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 wait. I've already said that. All right, let's just go straight pushback. Release parking brakes. All right, let's release our parking brake. Uh, they asked me the same question twice. That's all good. Commencing push. Due to icing conditions, please stand by for engine start until pushback. Ah, they don't want to start the engines until we get pushed back, y'all. So that's okay. Get a flight director set. Get that flight director's turned on. Uh, let's get our climb altitude set for uh, climbing rate as far as 1,800 feet per minute. We want to set our climb ratio for. Uh, make sure while we're getting pushed back that we didn't miss anything here, y'all. Let me see. All right, we got our trim set. We got our the speed set for our takeoff speeds. We got thrust set for. Okay, take off thrust there. All right, all that looks good, all that looks good. What else we have? Um, our performance there, we got our fuel loaded. Let me double check our fuel, y'all, just to make sure we got, we should have 37, what says 111,000 pounds of fuel. Is that, is that right? Fuel should be 95,000. We're showing 111,000. Uh, we'll take some extra. I don't mind. Probably gonna need it anyway. That's, I think that's a good amount of fuel we have in there. It's quick, good cross check. All right, set our parking brakes. Like the pushback is. Oh, cool. Pushback is good. Set our parking brakes. All right. Thrust, take off. Speed. Yeah, everything's done, y'all. Everything's good to go. Cool. Unlocking gear.
About to get his engine started up there. Beautiful airport, y'all. It's definitely good out on. I'm happy to purchase. Got to get my display lights. Want to see tone up my display lights here. Let's see. Oh, no. Working on these display. We'll, we'll figure out these display lights as we get going here. I want to brighten some things up here. Oh, it might be down here actually. What up? Um, I think our display lights are down here somewhere. These are flood lights here. Got those up. Perfect. Instruments. Got that. All right, clear to start his engine, y'all. All right, this is the start of up. Is this engine number? Let's see, how do we start this bird up? There we go. Engine start. Start right engine first. It's coming up online. Give us some juice there, fuel. And right engine starting up. Okay, so we got right engine starting on us. Trying to turn us some lights down here, y'all. Let me see. Bear with me here. So we got the right engine starting up. Here I go. got some lights coming on here. Okay, we got now we got to work on these next layer of lights here. So engine number two, like she's firing up on us, which is good. Get that up and going. Man, we need some lights on there, y'all. Ah, cool. See if this is our okay, we can brighten up there. Cool. Brighten that up right there. All right, so engine number two's up. Let's get engine number one up and going here. Just start on that. It is coming up online. Fire up some juice in there. All right, so engines, both engines are coming up online, y'all. Excellent. There she is. Our altimeter is 2997. Make sure that has been updated or not. 2997 is our altimeter. We'll set our altimeter now. Okay, 2997 set. All right, how's our second engine look like? Our first engine, I mean, our first engine. Second turn up. Okay, she's running. She looks all good. All right, so our hydraulics now should be operational now. Our hydraulics should have enough pressure in there. And I can go ahead and um, bring those wings down to 10%. Bring our flaps down to 10%. All right, flaps are coming down. There they go. Cool. Like sun starting to come out here too in Toronto. All right, well let's go ahead and uh, taxi this bird to runway two three and let's get her up in the air, huh? All right. <clears throat> okay, release these brakes. Give a little bit of throttle. Let's get her up and go.
we're going to taxi in runway 23 via Alpha. And this is our next taxiway coming up there. Yeah, we should have our taxi lights up too, right? Don't we? Ah, there we go. Let's turn them on here. Alright, y'all. Let's, let's put this Dreamliner up in the sky. We do have live traffic going on as well, too, which is great. Keep realism going here, right? Uh, let's check the weather. Let's put the weather on here. Let's see, select traffic. Okay, we got traffic select. Been feeling trapped down on the floor. I don't know what for. Feels like I'm gonna lose. Silence takes a hold. I can't let it go. Chain up, no one knows. But I won't let the stormy seas throw me in open water. Let me have my peace and lead me to tomorrow. Wind into myself. Away from things I let go, floating on the way. We go bottoms up, we go all the way. When you're feeling down, push the pain away. We go bottoms up, we go all the way. And face the another day. We go bottoms up. Aviation, aviation man. Welcome back, man. Happy Easter to you as well, brother. Happy Easter to you as well. I gotta go right away. Though maybe tomorrow. Sounds good, man. Thanks for checking in with us, man. Thanks for coming through, man. Appreciate it, man. Have a good rest of your day, man. We're a little heavy. We're going to take uh, the extended full length of runway here for our departure. There we go. Alright, so we're just going to turn our departure lights on now. Just line up, get immediate departure. We see nothing coming in, so we're the line up now. Just get up in the sky. Got departure lights all on, strobe lights on, engines nice and warmed up. Let's shut our APU off. Is this the dash nine, dash ten? No, um, this is the um, the Dreamliner Boeing seven eight seven Max which is AKA 787-10. Let's go ahead and shut off uh, that APU. APU's off. Looks like I think we're ready, huh? Are ready to do this? All right, let's get our maps up on the side here so I can make sure I'm monitoring the map there on our departure. Virto, that's what we're gonna be departing out of here. Make sure 
gonna set that. Cool. Berto is set. Excellent. All right. Let's see. Let me set the other Berto map here. I'm sorry, y'all. Look at the screen I'm looking at here. Setting our maps up. So make sure we pin our departure maps there in place. All right. So I can follow and track that as we're getting up. All right, folks. Without no further ado, let's give it the beans. Let's roll. Arcade, right on, brother. Let's do this, man. Woo! He's pressing. See? set. All throttles on. Set our autopilot. Autopilot set to. Quick, quick visual on the external here. Nice, nice, nice. Pretty. There we go, folks. That's, that's what that's the takeoff I'm talking about right there. Huh? That is a takeoff for you right there. Clouds too on this takeoff. Nice takeoff. Speeds across the 200 knots. It's going to go up on our flaps some more. All right, man. Aviation man, we'll see you, brother. Right, let's go flaps all the way up here. We're right, about to turn. We got turn for um, Sevar waypoint here, folks. Good climb. Let's go ahead and front. let's go ahead and uh, make our turn here. Let's see. Select the heading, and we'll go ahead and start making our turn. right now across 11,000 feet 404 knots climbing
cross over Toronto City Center, huh? That's downtown Toronto. We're looking at down there, I think. Fourteen thousand folks climbing up to initial cruise out to thirty-three thousand feet. Toronto City Center, flying right over that, about five miles off of that. Right, shut off our departure lights. What's up, Pro Gamer? What's happening, man? What's going on, Pro Gamer? Thanks for joining us. Well, here we go, man. Get up out of Toronto. Get up outside of Toronto here. We're on route here. We are Virdo, Sid, departure. Flight Simmer. Fly Simmer. Man, shout out to you, man. What's happening, brother? Man, shout out for you, man. Thanks for jumping on board with us, man, for this flight, bro. Happy, happy Sunday. Happy Easter. We're crossing 21,000 feet. Arkin said, "Is there extra seats for business class?" Hey, man, we only got we only actually we do have we have two available seats, man. You and a companion, man, come join us, man. We do have seats, actually B two and B three. Roger, hey, Roger that, man. If you want to hop up on there, man, we got room for you. Come on up there, brother. <laughs> yeah, man, you definitely got first class, man. Crossing out at 23,000 feet on our climb. Nice climb, y'all. We're holding a good speed, too. Speed is still climbing. We've got 496 knots in climbing on the speed as well, too. Like right, Sim, you said, uh, I'm going to join that first class, brother. Oh, man, there you go. <laughs> I knew that second seat was going to be taken. Folks, we are now sold out officially. No more seats available in first class. 
Give you Connie. Please find your seats and coach. Settle in. Keep your feet up. And let's go for this ride. You guys got it, man. Right on. <laughs> Hey Arkin, hey, was that um, was that your ass to flight sim or was that for me? <laughs> hey, what y'all think about that scenery, huh? What y'all think about uh, the visuals here? We're at twenty-five thousand feet. About the pocket here when I climb up to 33,000. She's looking beautiful out here, man. Got smashed off through those layer clouds. S smooth flight from here. <laughs> oh, that was for me. Uh, you see, um, favorite aircraft, man. Um, damn, man. Shoot, man, I got multiple favorites, man. I, I don't know, man. It's kind of hard to say, man. I, let me go from one to three. How's that? Can I give you one to three? Otherwise, my top dog being number one. Mediocre being number two. And still up there. I'll give you my number three. My number one, man, I got to give it to PMDG. PMDG 737-8, man. Best model aircraft out here, man. PMDG is doing a phenomenal job with the model aircraft. Uh, you know, it's kind of small, kind of small in the ass, right? It's not heavy, but I'm going to tell you, man, I love it because the house model, man. It's so close to a true, true aircraft dynamics, man. But number two is going to be Airbus 320. Airbus 320, fly by wire Neo. That's my second best right there. It is. That's my second best, y'all. That's my second best for sure, man. Yeah, definitely got to give a big shout out to that Neo, man. Airbus 320, man. That's my second rated there. And now we got down, get down to number three, man. What's my number three? <laughs> oh, man. All right, so. Oh, man. There's a lot of things that can fit in the number three. But I will say, overall, my experience yesterday with that wonderful, beautiful C700. Y'all knew that was coming. Learjet. C700, man, that private that we flew yesterday, man, I give it much love, man. So it has to be up there in my top three, dude. So my, my C700, man, is my number three. I'm hands down, dude. I mean, you fly 45,000 feet above the rest of the traffic out here, and you can, like, catapult yourself across the skies in luxury, and it's modeled well, too. Right on, man. It's got to be my number three, man. That's where I'm at, man. It's one of my favorites, man, so far. Imagine doing a flight from Perth to Chicago. I wonder how long that flight will be. So we are crossing 30,000 30, feet. I want to climb up to 33,000 feet for our initial climb. Yo, we gotta fill out. We got a 2,700. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, that's actually not bad, man. Oh, 3,700. Oh, no, no. Oh, he put another thousand on there. <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, you put another. You put another G on there, man. Put another thousand on there. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. You went to 4,000 now? Hold up, man. Let me see. Oh, oh, I said for, um, for A350. <laughs> Y'all, why are we climbing? Let's uh um, oh, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, you giving your top five. Oh, your top five. I'm sorry. There you go. Okay, let's see. Let's see what you got here, man. 
Let's see what you got here for your top five, man. Let's, let's read them out here. Let's see. All right, see what we got here, man. All right, so. Number one. Number one for you, Arkin, is at 737 Max. Right on, man. Good choice, good choice, good choice. Right, right, right. And uh, Flight Sim, we're going to check you out in a second. Let's see, Arkin, your number two is what? What's this? Triple, uh, triple seven. See, here's my problem, man. Is that, um, you know, I, 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 the triple seven would have been up there with me as well, too. But unfortunately, man, it's not. Uh, it's not. Uh, we don't have that for Microsoft Flight Sim. Well, they have it, but they don't have. The one I'm looking for, the PMDG. PMDG is going to be releasing that 777 soon for Microsoft Flight Sim, and I cannot wait, man. It's going to be top for me. But good choice there, man. You got the 747 too, man. Don't leave home without that one. That's an angel in the sky right there, brother. 747, man. Good choice there, man. Oh, Airbus 350. your number four. Oh, you got the ultimate. You got the ultimate beast there. The Airbus 380. Yes, sir. Airbus 380, man, makes a statement. But again, that's another one, man, I'm waiting for Microsoft Flight Sim to come off with, man. I'm going to tell you, I'll be first in line, man, to purchase those aircrafts, man. Good choices there. Hey, Flight Simmer, what you got there, man? So what you got? Let me see. You got a top six going. Let's start with your top one here, number one. Uh, not bad. Not bad on that. Um, you know, I would say the 747, man. Um... Damn, man, I, I don't know, dude. Nah, I'm not saying I don't know about the 747. I'm just saying. My, my top three, man, like that 747 should be in there, right? Because I, I do like that 747, man. That's a good choice for that top one, top number one there. Definitely, definitely, definitely flight. Good for your top one. Number one, what you got for number two there? Flight. Flight sim, what you got, man? You got the Airbus 330. Not bad, not bad. Not Airbus 330-900. Uh, so that's, that's where we're currently flying right now. Not now, but as so we've been flying lately. We've been flying at A330 now, 100. So, uh, man, good choice there, man. 737-8. Um, uh, I'm sure that's by PMDG, right? 737-8 PMDG, of course, man. Best modeled aircraft on the flight sim thus far. Got the Airbus 320. Can't leave home without that one. A321 Neo. Absolutely. Those are your top five. You got a top six, I see you said down here, right? Um, oh, triple seven, three hundred ER. Man. Yeah, man. But again, you know, man, that's gonna be um, uh, once it's official. Um, that's gonna be one of my top ones as well, man. Triple seven. But uh, I know P. I got big. I got a lot of trust and faith in PMDG. They're gonna release a nice one for Microsoft Flight Sim, right? Right, right. Arky said, "Flight Sim, we got you." <laughs> oh. Yeah, you said two of yours ain't out yet. Yeah, that's all good though. Um, yeah, man, you guys make some phenomenal choices, man. As far as your top, top, top dogs there, man. Hey, but you know what's common across the board? I think it's an Airbus three, three twenty Neo, man. I'll fly by wire, man. I think that's common across the board as far as the top one, man. I think that might just still get the high rankings of most most all flights out there, man, to be honest with you. So I see that's kind of even across the board there, man. Yeah, man. Good choices, y'all. Right on, man. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all, we got to figure out. We're going to figure out this, uh, this, um... This um, air traffic control situation that we're dealing with here, man. Let's. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and fire up Vats, uh, Vatsim again, and connect once again here. Let's see if we get some audio with these guys, man. Okay, so let, let's 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 see if we get. Um, let's see if we can tune in here, man. Get some. Uh, Get an audio fix there. We gotta figure something out here. Yeah, I, I'm sure, man. It might be us, y'all. I'll be honest with you. It might be us here, but let me see something here. We got Boston online, right? We got Boston out there. Let me test it a little bit on these other frequencies, y'all. We might we might get something out of like the center versus the left and right. Okay, let's do Boston 134.70. See if we can get them. We're gonna get this going, man. Uh, one Boston's 134.7, right? Let's get Boston on there just to see. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
All right, let's get, let's get, come on, let's get the second one going there. Come on. Or oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. I hope it had nothing to do with this. I hope it had nothing to do with. Hold on. I hope it had nothing to do with this. This here, here. Let me see. Make sure. Uh, what'd you say, Flight Simmy said? Um. All right, I'm gonna go eat my breakfast. Ah right, man, go get that breakfast in you, man. Come on back to us later, brother. Get that breakfast in you, man. We'll, we'll be here. We'll be here. We'll be here. Get that breakfast, man. You see, I love how um, I uh, flown for the Dreamliner from Amsterdam to Calgary. Oh, so you've already flown this one, huh? You've already made that flight, huh? Kudos to you, brother. One three four point seven. Yeah, kudos to you, man. This is a long flight right here, dude. All right, let's transfer, let's transfer Boston in on this frequency. See if that's gonna make a difference there. Um, let's see what happens, y'all. Trying to get the audio going here. Once I hear them, then they're gonna be able to hear us, right? All right. Um. See what else we have here. Make sure that I'm not missing anything here. Um, I don't know why it's not. Can't hear these guys here. Our volume is up. Let's go the other way on that. Right now we're tuning in to uh, uh, Boston 134.7. And we're showing, let me show y'all real quick. So, <clears throat> we're showing active, right? For the, for the, um, for uh, the center, right? We're showing active. Um, you can see us as well, too. On uh, VATSIM right here, right? You can see us on VATSIM. Our flight plan is still filed. We got five hours and 44 minutes before we arrive in Amsterdam. Our flight plan is in place. Everything looks good, right? We just gotta get the the comms going, man. We're gonna get it going. We're gonna get it going. We're gonna get it going. Uh, Arkansas travel two or three times a year. What's crazy? Hey man, it's all good, man. I mean, shoot, man. I, mean, I love traveling, dude. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I love to travel, man. Hey, let's get our. Uh, so, I'm looking to see when we're gonna get the uh, cross channel uh, the sound connectivity coming through, because that's when that comms one will light up the RX right there for receiving transmission. So, I'm still gonna keep playing with this to see if it's us or not, man. Going to Milan, Italy in July. Oh man, Milan, man. Been there and done that, man. That's a great place. Have you been there before? Have you been to Milan before, man? It's a cool spot, man. Yeah, Milan's a cool spot, man. All right, let's, let's check on let's check on our flight, y'all. Make sure we're good here. Man, yeah, she's a beauty, man. Look at that. All right, so where are we at? Let's look at. Let's see where we're at on the map, too. We, um, yeah, we're stretching out there, y'all. Different views we have options for to see. Let's see. Um, that view is okay. That view is a little more subtle. That view is not so busy. All right. well, let's see if we can. Um, one second. Okay, so I'm taking some things out. That's what I'm doing. Oh no, we don't, we don't want that. It's too busy. Uh, let's see. That's, uh, oh, that's uh, towers. That's tower right there. We can select to see different towers we have nearby. Nah, I don't need that. What is this? 
What's this option here? Uh, show or hide infrastructure map. We don't need that either. Ah, we definitely need lines drawn. So we can see what's what. And we don't need waypoints. It's too busy as well. Map layers. It's a good one to choose there. I keep playing with this map, y'all. I want to also look at and give y'all um, a good uh, view on. Um, we see Arkin. You said uh, also I'm doing a Milan. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Um, oh, you said you haven't been there, man. Oh snap, man. Milan is cool spot, dude. Um, yeah, man. I'm. I know you hyped about that one. Heck yeah, brother. Hey, look. If you get an opportunity, we should go to Milan, the fashion capital. Of course, Milan, you know, you know, bring back something nice, man. But when you're in Milan, man, um, don't forget about um, up north, which is not far, probably like about an hour, 20 minute drive, hour, 20 minute drive north, Lake Como, man. If you, if you got opportunity, man, slip up to Lake Como and enjoy, uh, enjoy the lake, man, up there uh, with the surrounding Alps, man. I think that's again, like I said, about an hour 20, maybe hour 30 minutes out from Milan, North. Check it out, man. Don't miss that while you're there, man. Take advantage of that, bro. Man, 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 man. I'm, I'm happy for you on that trip, man. Please, when you do go, man, do not forget to come back and give us some updates on how that trip was, man. All right, let's uh, let's uh, draw this map in here. Um, I want to look at the weather. Let's see what the weather looks like, Ken. There's nothing going on here. Oh, we got some stuff going on down there, but we're up in the clear, y'all. Look, activity, a movement, clouds, storms, it's all down there, right? Look, like we're good. Where are we at? All right. Cut the mats off. All right, so one thing I do want to look at here is um, the wind bar. Let's see our tailwinds here. 33,000 feet. Where we're at? 34,000. Wind bar is going to give us. This is our tailwinds, folks, that we're looking at on our trip here. So let's see one little bar. Uh, do I got a marker? Do I can mark on the screen? Now I don't have a marker. All right, so I, mean, I should have a marker on the screen. Hold on. Nah, I don't have a marker. It's all good here. Let's get back to it. All right, let's get that back up. I thought I had a marker here so I could mark and show you. But right here um, in front of us, we have that one bar, which is like 50, 55 knots of winds hitting us. Then we get the Imani, Imana. We have uh, 25 knots of wind, tailwinds, which is not, it's not nothing early. Um, you see what flight am I doing tomorrow? Um, yeah, I think it's gonna be a Mexico flight, um, Air Aero Mexico. We got a we got that schedule. We got a schedule. We got to knock out for Aero Mexico, man. We got a few flights ahead of us. Probably like four or five flights. We got to knock out for the 737 Aero Mexico based on our schedule. So it's definitely gonna be Aero Mexico. It's probably gonna be like an hour and a half flight. No, actually, by that hour flight from um, Guadalajara, Guadalajara, Mexico to Mexico City. I think is what it is tomorrow. It'll be a short flight, but it'll be cool though, man. Um, uh, we don't have much tailwinds, y'all. Direct tailwinds on our trip, man. We got a lot of winds hitting us from north, south, right? And the most we're going to have hitting us in the ass here is going to be a tailwinds coming out of here. It's going to be 50 knots right here, right? Oh, well, we can sit down 500 and 45 knots right now, so I can't complain about that. Not bad. Yeah, we have the, we have our schedule. We got knock out, brother, for um for Mexico, man. Let me show our schedule. Let me explain to you uh, what I mean by our schedule here. One sec. Let me explain that to you real quick, Eric. One more second. Here. Um, let me explain that schedule to you. What's coming up here? All right, where is? There we go. He's coming up now. 
Right. This is, all right. Oh, by the way, folks, we're at our cruise altitude of 33,000 feet, too, by the way. Let me show you what I mean by, by uh, our schedule here. If you all don't have it, I recommend you get it. Right? Simbit World, a pilot's life, y'all. This is some fun stuff here. If you don't have it, get it, folks. Jump on and get it. I'm now ranked captain. It took a while to get up to captain. But you got, you got, it's just like, uh, there's real flights, right? Real flights that you fly. You get hired by airlines to knock out schedules, you get promoted as you go along. You get denied schedules, you get accepted schedules, you gotta apply for jobs, right? This is really cool, y'all. Um, check it out. Job market, man, takes you right into where you choose, where you wanna say, hey, I wanna work for this airliner, I wanna work for that airliner. If I wanna look at the top, the top five airliners, here's the top five airliners out there, right? Five star, top five star airliners, right? And you can apply for jobs for any of these airliners, right? You get any information like, um, let's go for like Swiss Airlines, right? Put information on the five-star rated Swiss Airlines, right? They have flights. Here's their, here's their flights, y'all, that we can apply for. But you got to have these air aircraft. You got to have 777, 330, 300, Airbus 320, uh, and Barrier 190, uh, Airbus 320 again, 321. In order for you to get it, uh, um, accepted for the job to fly for Swiss Airlines, you got to have those aircrafts, man. And you got to purchase those aircrafts. If you don't purchase, you're not going to be accepted to have a schedule, right? They're not going to they're not, they're turn your job off or down, man. You make money, too. Well, you make sim money on this, right? Not cash money. You make sim money. But our schedule right now, we have left to complete our schedule is one, two, three, four, five flights. For Air Aero Mexico, based on what we got hired to do, and then we'll apply for new jobs, y'all. Uh, Guadalajara to Mexico City, that's the top one. That's for tomorrow. Then we got Mexico to Monterey. Then we're gonna reverse, go back from Monterey to Mexico. Man, they got us going back to man. Come on, Mexico to Monterey again. Monterey to Mexico, back and forth. All right, so once we finish this up, bro, well, then we're done. We're finished. We're finished. We can get a new airliner to fly anywhere in the world and apply for those jobs, right? So that's what, um, that's, uh, that's the reason why we should try to stick to a schedule and apply for jobs in different locations. It's really fun, man. I love it a lot, man. It's really great, man. It's good stuff. You say, how about Paris to Heathrow? It's a challenge to fly. Heathrow to Paris, huh? See, that's a challenge, huh? Well, I wonder why is that? Why is why is why why is it a challenge? Just because of uh, comms or traffic? Or, uh, airport? I'm always up for a challenge, man. I just heard boss just make a, a sound there. Yeah, so let me see if they can hear us now here. Hey, uh, boss, and uh, this is KLM 1979. Radio check. Nah, they can't hear us. Nope. Yeah, man, this is... I don't know. Test, test, test. Test, test, test. Ah, oh, I think I got it right here. I think I figured out the reason why, folks. Let me see here. We'll give me a second. Radio check, radio check. Back on that. One second here. We got my settings here, folks. Give me one second here. Radio check. 
Radio check. Radio check. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll, I'll just keep messing around with it later. Cool. Let's just fly, folks. Oh, he's getting a land. Land between buildings, huh? Oh, wow, land through the city area. I like that, man. There's two airports in um, London. Uh, there's Heathrow and there's another one that's in the city. Like, literally, like, on the river bed of the city. It's a smaller airport, which I land there. I land at both airports. But that one, man, the smaller airport that's uh, by the stadium, downtown area, right off the river. Oh, man, there's a lot of buildings down there in London as far as trying to land in the airport, man. It's not Heathrow, but it's the one that's right there in the city. But it's a, it's a cool airport, man. Both of them are really great, man. Good airports, man. Yeah, that's a good choice, though, actually. Let me see if we got anything over here in association with comms here. Uh, no, it's not. It's gonna be... It's not gonna have anything. Um, alright. Let's get over here now. Start looking around, see what's what here. Um... <clears throat> Got position. Oh, we can do position report. Oh, cool. Well, I like the position report there. We can do. I reference our current position there. We got a climb forecast. Oh no, okay. Oh, we can request for a climb forecast. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that was... Load on route data page. Oh, really? Man, I didn't know we had a climb forecast that we could have put in. Oh, that is cool, man. I missed out on that one. It's all good. I know now. Let's get, on, let's get back down here to uh, comms here. We got to figure out why um, or we're not able to execute. One, two, two, that's one, eight. Let's go ahead and put that in there. Transfer that in. So that looks like that's updated. Go London City Airport. There you go. Yeah, I'm with you on that one, man. 
Yeah, that's uh, so the the, the the aircraft I flew yesterday, the Cessna Longitude C700. I flew that um, from Austria, Vienna, Austria, to uh, London, um, to downtown. Yeah, for London City Airport, and it was in the middle of a storm too. And man, that was a cool flight, man. That was fun. That was actually enjoyable, man. I miss those kind of flights, man. I got to put those back on the radar. We're gonna have some step climbs. Step climbs from 33,000 feet. We're gonna climb up higher. Let's just see on our plan as to when we're gonna do some step climbs here. So we're gonna next step climbs. Actually, let's go ahead and press up to 37,000 now. We're at 33,000. Let's gonna press up 37,000 now. We're already cleared for that. Um, let's go make that happen. 37,000. Let's make it happen. I think our, I think all this is. Yep, it's already preset. Thirty-seven thousand. Let's do it. Bike change. Here we go. Let's climb. Three seven zero. Yeah, I did stream that, man. I streamed that, dude. Um, it's in the uh, C seven hundred. It should be in the C seven hundred folder. Um, yeah, it should be the C700 folder, man. Yeah, that was, that was, that was a fun stream there, man. I need to do an updated one, though, on that one for sure. We need to do an updated one on that. That was a while ago, actually. I was climbing up to... Climbing from 33,000 feet up to 37,000. And our, our winds may change too, folks, at 37 feet as far as the wind bar. Let's see if we get a difference as far as some uh, tailwinds here. We're at 34,000 feet here, as you've shown. Let's get up to let's go 38. Eh, not a big difference, huh? Uh, wasn't that, not a big difference. That's all good. Yeah. I'm a blow trotter. You and I, pick your nah, hot your mouth, who didn't know that we just different at your water. Georgia, I'm a Jimmy, I'm a Sasha, I'm a All right, folks, here we go. We're shelling out at 37,000 feet. Um, and we're going to hold that altitude until we get to... Actually, that's going to be our top altitude here for this trip here, 370.
called Billin to Wellington. What's the, what's the distance on that one? I mean, uh, how long is that play? You said long. Is it longer than this flight here, actually? of me flying sims <laughs> and being on a uh, flight sim 20, 28 hours I won't have it this lifetime <laughs> I'm sorry brother 28 hours 28 hours 28 hour flight nah not in this lifetime brother I won't be flying that one I like to know who does fly it though I like to know that experience Oh, because, oh, it's hold up. You talking about for layovers? It's layovers, huh? You said way too long though, but you love, love your flights though. Right on, bro. Appreciate that, man. Man, I apologize, man. I had y'all sitting there looking at that boring map there, man. My apologies. I gotta, I gotta watch how my fingers press these buttons. Huh? <laughs> y'all don't want to see me looking at no map on the flight. Y'all want to see scenery, huh? Let's keep it here on the content. <laughs> We got spring down here in the States, but we still got snow up north in Canada, of course. Snow probably going to be there still for a while. I don't know if north of the States is pretty cool up here. 
up in the northern hemisphere. Like I say, I tell you what, you can see why you're playing autopilots. I don't think that's fun, though. Nah, man, I mean, it's, uh, you're talking about time, like, flights like this, man. I mean, you gotta get up, stretch up, stretch out, stretch your legs up, man. walk around a little bit, do this, do that. Go fix you some soup or something, right? Go fix you something to drink, man. Go get a snack or two, whatever, whatever, whatever. whatever. Kick your feet up. You know, don't doze off, don't nap. You gotta keep your eyes on controls. You never know what might be happening. So, yeah, man, it's just normal, man. You can't just sit in one spot the whole time. It's impossible, dude, right? Try, try, try to stop talking back 
I'm trying to still figure out this comms. Oh, oh wow, you said hey, you guys were also out of fuel? Oh my gosh. That's horrible, man. Right? Not good at all there, man. That case. That's a bad, bad situation. Long-term goals tend to change. 
about goals that are reachable, it can allow you to have a longer reach of longer term goals. Every day just mount out to everything you do and work on and accomplish and be successful in it. That's going to be that long term reach goal for whatever that goal is in the near future, which I have many of them, number one is being successful. A lot of things start coming to you and different goals change as it comes along. Number one for me is successful, man. Destinations and places to go, and I'll come back and I'll be streaming again. One step forward, two steps backwards, yeah. And much your lover who don't use big words, yeah. Man, I think, um, I'm, I'll be serious with you. I think the uh, flight I did the other day to Korea was my longest flight, actually. That was 14 hours um, from Chicago to 
um, no, it was from Atlanta. It was Atlanta, South Korea, Seoul, South Korea. I did that the other day. That was 14 hours. I think that's got to be my longest flight, man. I, I do want to do a uh, Emirates Airline Emirates Airline flight from um, Washington Dulles to um, the Middle East. I do want to do uh, Emirates flight, man. Which is, I think that would be a good one there as a uh, as a uh, long long haul flight there. Somewhere in the Middle East. I don't know, probably Dubai or something. Dubai, maybe Kuwait. Or like that from um, Washington Dallas Emirates Airlines. If I do a flight from Dubai, let's see, if you do a, a flight, if you do a flight from Dubai to Japan, <laughs> oh man, Dubai to Japan, huh? Oh man, nah, that'd be something to think about there, man. I see Toronto's back online. Ah, uh, man, let me see if I can uh, press this frequency again. Let's see, 125, 125, 125, 125, 125, 125, 125, 125, See if I did something else on the back in here. One second, one second. Go into my settings. I'm on the side doing something here, folks. You can't see it, but uh, we're going to some audio stuff here. Mexico for tomorrow. It's gonna be probably late evening East Coast time. I'm sure that's gonna be pretty late your time because um, yeah, like four hours later than now. So that's gonna be pretty late your time actually. Um, flight said I do. Um, see, so your your regional area here. Um, flights like this time is probably be the only really time that you'll be able to. Be on board, but you may be able to catch me Thursday, probably Thursday or Friday. My flights on those days, which I may get those up um, earlier in the day, such as like around about now. 
But, uh, yeah, most of my flights be... Like, evening. Tomorrow it'll be evening flight after 4 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, which is really late your time. It's probably already, what, like 10? 10, 10 o'clock your time out there, but... Yeah, man. Well, oh, actually, later than that for you, I think. Yeah, boss is doing a job, man. Just keep things in order. Man, that means that you're really into it, man. That's where that's coming from. You got your mindset to it, man. That's what happens. Yeah, good stuff, man.
that you thought grass was green on that other whole side. Guess what? I'ma help you decide. Tattooed on my tears. No, I swear that you won't catch me cry. Got no reasons left to rewind. I gave you my word. Try it again. I'll put you on a bench. Do not disdain. To think I used to dream of being. too much mm. it's like i've got no sense of touch i'm always pouring out my heart no little by little here i'm always pushing things too far two five six ten drinks at the bar no boundaries, I get too close No little by little here Cause I give my all Oh, no little by little I pour out my heart oh, No little by little here I always run The jump and rest the fall. I see no limits in the sky. No little by little here. No, no, got stuck on working on myself. Thought I was wrong and needed help. But I'm just different, something else. No little. Cause I get my oh, 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 o
Aviation, welcome back, man. Welcome back. Arkin. Man, Nightbot gave you a spanking, didn't she? Man, she put you at what? Well, she put you at, uh, at rest for like 10 minutes, didn't she? Man, don't play with Nightbot, bruh. I tell you, man, she keeps ordering the court, bruh. Uh, what's up, Aviation? Welcome back, man. Welcome back. <laughs> Arkin said, I hate that. I hate the bot. Hey, man, it's much needed, dude. Trust me, man, that bot is much needed, man. Everyone who streams, they all, mostly anybody and everybody has um, has a bot on the background, man. It, you, you definitely need it, man. It, gets, uh, uh, it allows you to keep order, dude, you know, big time. It tracks a lot, though, man. The bot, I'm gonna tell you, man, the bot tracks. Like, I can go to the bot and get, like, uh, like she tells me who have been my, my regulars on the channel, who has sent most communication chats on the channel, who's done the most repeats and what have you. So it, it highlights each person as people who can be selected as favorites on your channel as well too. She rates everybody. She rates everybody that's here, man. I tell you, it's like you have your admin assistant, man, sitting here on your channel doing a lot of things for you, man. So you can't knock it, dude. Um, so aviation, man, we got some time left ahead of us, dude. Um, this is a um, long haul flight, dude, as we know it, man, from coast to coast. Um, our descent is not, it's gonna be for a while, dude. It's gonna be, um, we still have, um, still got four hours, oh, four hours and 50 minutes. Nah, not as not as long as I thought it was gonna be. But well, four hours and fifty minutes will be um we'll be descending for um Amsterdam at that time. <laughs> Where'd you say Arkham? See we're cursing over the Atlantic Ocean. <laughs> Alright, so where are we at, at located folks? We're 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 almost out there in the waters. I think it's Newfoundland. We're about to cross over Newfoundland maybe? What is this? Um St. John's, Canada. About to, we're still, we're still coming on, coming out of Canada here. But uh, yeah, man, we're making our ways on through, ways on across. Still can't connect to. Um, have an issue still with this uh, Vatsim, man. With this, air, I think it's the aircraft though. I might have to, may have to do an update for this aircraft or Vatsim, man, because I'm not, I don't normally have issues with Vatsim, but um, I haven't flown a Dreamliner in a long time, man. So. It could be something I need to tweak here yeah, in the comms to get on, get a line with that symbols. Yep, but uh, let's keep it moving, man. Um, uh, let's see, y'all make sure to subscribe and like. <laughs> oh, you know, you, when you say I took over a bot, she's fired. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, man. You got to make friends with what well, we got to make friends with with the bot, bruh. She has good intentions. She has good intentions, man. She has good intentions. <laughs> Gregory, welcome on board. Gregory. Hello. Is your multiplayer on? On which server are you, please? Uh, multiplayer is not on, actually. I just avoid the um, the kamikazes and stuff when you got people going out the sky, running to your aircraft, and interfering with your stream. You get a lot of crazies, man, on multi-stream, on multiplayer. So I, I just, I just, I'm on Vatsim, which I think you probably probably know what bad sim is not all introduce it to you man but i'm flying amongst the rest of the network here all these other pilots that we're flying with here uh, on that and i'm also flying with live traffic that i have uh feed it into the sim as well too but multiplayer nah sorry brother i gotta keep them off the stream bro you get a lot of unnecessary interference dealing with multiplayers man but anyhow um, Arkin, he said, oh, only she can do 
Just say stop caps. <laughs> Trust me, she can do a lot more than that, man. Um, I see people use different words that they should not be using, and man, they've got destroyed by Nightbot totally. So she doesn't play, man. I love it actually. <laughs> All right, when you got when you got when she when she when she blocked you for ten minutes, man. Uh, man, I was like, damn, man. You meet the, you you meet you a new friend, dude. You meet you a new friend, man. Oh, I was cracking up, dude. I was oh my gosh, she got me. <laughs> of course, of course, of course, of course, always, man. What do you say to aviation? Oh, uh, you're the best streamer, man. Right on, brother. Man, I love the compliment, dude. That's what's up, man. Appreciate that, man, from you. Hey, thanks for that, man. Really appreciate it. <laughs> and, and Ark, can you double down on that, man? I yeah, appreciate it, folks. Always try to have fun here, man. I just like the entertainment of it, man. Have a good company and everything, man. Flying like we're doing right now across the pond. You know, on the other side of the globe here. Always, man. It's fun, man. Have good folks on board, man. Keep collaboration going, man. Keep making it enjoyable, man. You know, so really appreciate y'all, man. Thanks. Out of touch with my feelings, dress and appearances. Feeling more solid about who the man in the mirror is. I reach for hearts through the speaker box to connect with strangers. Painting the page with the language, but off the mic, I barely speak it all. I seldom see a flaw, bitch, I need it all. Shook by the way life is lately. I feel the earth pirouette. I'm dazed like I'm seeing stars. Got them all on the wave. It's more than just words to a page. Just feel like I'm hosting a reading long, and I'm speaking tongues. No translation. I'm out the bottle. I'm grieving, leaving the beat. Need a CPR. I'm disconnected. I feel the pressure. I need acceptance from the crevice. Well, all my homies on something special. They subtle flexing. They still they hella selfish. Chasing a bag, but it's good. They don't need the Franklins to keep it a hundred. I'm seeing shit down the barrel. I named that gun right America. Armed with the ink that I'm flaring up in my element. We losing brothers to bullshit. We need protection because real niggas is rare enough. I rewrite the narrative. I conquer that feet alone. Got the needle jumping like bungee. I'm in the field like I'm hunting. The work is dope off the burner. I'm calculated. I'm sorry. Ah, man. You just broke it down your first, your top, your top uh, streamers, man. That's cool. What's the coolest thing about it, man? You got me listening to your number one, man. That's what's up, dude. You got number five, Spy Cakes. You put number four, it's show speed. You got number three. Mark Kipler, you got number two, Corpus Skin, and that number one, man, the Clintons, number one, the Clintons, man, you put the Clintons on the map, man, appreciate that, man, from you, man, oh, man, that's cool, man, right on with that, dude. Talk is dense, I'm trying to make sense of it, my stomach turning between this lit and the dissonance, I know some people that's feeling sick just existing here, brain blister been caught up deep in the thick of it. I lay and switch through the fog, it's hard to see where I'm headed But fuck it, ain't no turning back, the past is where we've been It feel like something missing And I've been out here on an impossible mission My head down to myself and I smile to stay in the moment While trying to stay up my feelings Trying to boost my subscribers, I'm trying to maintain the vision People that know me closest live different than what they show me It's hard to feel like they know me when I'm just scrolling through images Truth be told, I feel pain, but I'm on the pinnacle Been chasing this music thing for a minute though Know some good people that never see success. And here I am sitting worried about show appearances. With everything crazy, you still my source of peace. You built out the lows. You give me what I need. TSR goes. You the world, but it don't belong to me. It's feeling like it's not the closest I'll be. 
Happy Easter to you, man. Happy Easter. Yes, sir. I got, oh, he said, finally got Microsoft Flight Simulator. Man, that's what's up, man. You got to tell me how you like it. Oh, my goodness. No, you did aviation. Aviation, man. Man, you guys are killing me, man. Man, that's a good lookout, man. Aviation. Aviation, your top. Your top, um, your top five streamers you got, um, you got typical gamer, which has got number four, unspeakable. I mean, I like that. I like that name, unspeakable. Number three, you got Captain Canada. <laughs> oh, Captain Canada, man, that's a familiar one. You got number two, behind the skies. And man, 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 you put me number one too, man. Aviation lover, man, appreciate that, dude. Let's appreciate that, man. That's your top subscriber, man. You guys showing mad love today, man. Really feels good, man, to know that, man. You guys are enjoying yourselves, man. Anything I bring to the table, man. Bring good content, man. You know, I'll, I would do that, man. I'll give you guys mad love. Give you guys shout outs when it's needed, man. When y'all come on board, man. Really appreciate y'all, man. <laughs> Arkin, man, you having a good, yeah, man, you having, you having a little time right now, ain't you? <laughs> man so, so what's going on man so she fussing because you guys putting all caps like this hold on, hold on, hold on. like this is that what nightbots hitting you on like stuff like that I mean she she's not gonna bother me if she can, she wants to, she get fired. But is that what's uh is that what's going on behind the scenes here? Was she slapping y'all's hands? And stuff like that. But she ain't putting it on the screen. Fun fact, Captain Canada is live now. <clears throat> really? Man, that, that Captain Canada sounds familiar, man. <laughs> oh man she's keeping everybody lined up accordingly man that's all she's doing dude I, I, I wasn't sure I thought that could be the re reason why she's slapping hands around here because of that Can we see you? 
We see you. You're not timed out. If you did, man, wow, man, ain't nothing gonna beat that 10 minutes, man. She had you sitting down for 10 minutes, dude. I was like, oh, wow. Man, yeah, yeah, you made her upset, dude. Like, damn, what did you do, bro? Like, man, what did you do, man? 10 minutes? Oh. <laughs> oh, I hate to laugh, man, but that's kind of funny, man. <laughs> Guess that fairy tale and it ain't really come true. I'd rather be six feet deep than be stuck with you. Everything's blue. Everything's through. I know you can feel it. Oh, aviation when time out. Ooh. All I got was love. Uh oh. Uh oh. So we, um. I think it's um Is that Nova Scotia? I think. Not Nova Scotia, what I meant. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um Oh yeah, I think it might be I don't know. I oh, know it still says um uh, Saint John's Saint John's, Canada. That's where it's at, right here. We're almost we're almost out in the Atlantic. So. Almost. Almost. We're getting there. Calling your phone, why you not hitting me back? Please just pick up. Don't want to go. Let's look at our uh our chart map here. Oh, we're That's a better view. Now right in where we are here on our chart map here. This is not another love song. Girl, you got me and me sprung on. Love it like I know you picked it. Turn me crazy like I did so. Really knew you was the one no. Now you want to be done so. Help me say like a zip tie. Now you running on the run go. <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. Top fast food restaurants. Oh, you got Popeyes on that list. Oh, Mr. Beast Burger. Man, I haven't heard that one before. But that, that sounds delicious, though. You got that number, your number four. Raising, raising canes, raising canes, number three. Never heard that one either. Raising canes, that must be good though. You got that number three. Five guys up there. Whoa, Jack. 
Five guys make some the best burgers, man. But you got burgers twice, though. You got something else, too. As your number four, Mr. Beast Burger. And you got number one, McDonald's. Dude. Dude. Ooh. That's some heavy stuff there, man. You got number one, McDonald's. Man, I tell you. Number one fast food joint, McDonald's. Man, you guys are crazy, man. I ain't got no number ones. I ain't got no top fast food joints, bro. You guys, you guys on a whole nother level, man. <laughs> wow. You got McDonald's as number one, bro. You love those fries, don't you? Those fries do something special to you, don't you? Man, you ain't nothing like those McDonald's fries, y'all. Can't nobody make fries like McDonald's. French fries. You sit back and smack on those fries, dip in a little ketchup, man. You good to go then, huh? See, I only put only, you only put Popeyes there is because of um, the chicken sandwiches. Man, everybody loves that Popeye chicken sandwich, man. But people were standing in lines, they were selling out of chicken, bro. Because of those chicken salad, those chicken sandwiches, man. I couldn't understand it. But when I tried the chicken sandwich, I don't know. Maybe, maybe something was wrong with the Popeyes I went to. Maybe it's just the Popeyes I went to. That damn chicken sandwich, man, wasn't worth standing in that line for like that. Good gosh, man, it was lines out when the chicken sandwich first came out, man. The lines was like stretched, like like outside to get a chicken sandwich, dude. And when I got that chicken sandwich, man, I ain't standing no line for it. I waited for I think a year. A year plus before I even got a chicken sandwich after that. But when I finally got one, I couldn't understand it, man. I don't know. I couldn't understand it, dude. It was, I was kind of lost. I was kind of lost a little bit. You said, um, I'm on a diet. So you, you start your diet tomorrow? <laughs> man, all that fast food you speak, you should have started a diet a long time ago, brother. You just start your diet tomorrow? He said, tomorrow I'm going to start a diet. Funny, man. That's funny. You said you ain't started today though, because you got you got to get it down. You got to get down today, right? You got to get it in today. You said you'll start tomorrow, not today, right? <laughs> oh man, no one can miss out on a McFlurry and and Big Mac sandwich. Oh, that's your McDonald's favorites right there. You got McDonald's on the map. You said uh, you said you can't try the chick. Um, filet, Chick Fil A, Chick Fil A, Chick Fil A. Mm. You say how old am I? I'm just gonna say this much: I'm older than 45. Huh? <laughs> Oh yeah. I say like I'm older than 45, but feel like I'm busy fit to say I'm like 24, 25. <laughs> I'm always I'm all about health and fitness, man. With me, you know. Health and fitness, man. And, and uh, don't don't abuse my body. I don't abuse my body with drugs and alcohol. I don't do that. So. I know folks got their own regimen, but not here, man. Not here. It's all about health and fitness, man. Health and fitness is everything, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Let me, uh, let me, let me cam up. Let me cam up on you real quick, yeah. One second, stand by. I'm gonna cam up on y'all. I'm gonna cam up on y'all real quick. Give a quick shout out, man. I don't think I've done that in a long time, man. Let me see what's up here. Bam. That's what's up. There we go. 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 
What's up? What's up, folks? Quick cam up, man. I don't normally cam up that much, man. I cam up occasionally. But uh, not often. But you said you're in the fourth grade, man. Man, man, you just started, you just started, man. You ain't even started living yet, man. You just, you just started. Fourth grade? Yeah, man, you, you, you just, you just getting started, man. You get, you, you just like that brand new car. When you get that new car, you don't know about that yet. When you do get that new car, smelling all fresh, fresh leather, brand new wheels on it. Engine sounding really good. Synth engine sounding really nice. And they put that cheap gasoline in it. <laughs> and ten years later, man, it's raggedy, it's dragging, feet dragging, it's rusty, it makes sounds, weird noises, looks funny, it's awkward, smells funny, smoke coming out of it. Look, you're in fourth grade, man. You get on your health kick now, dude. Put that premium gas in your fuel tank, bruh. Eat good food, man. Eat good fuel. Eat good food. Take care of your body. And it will take care of you, man. Do all the right things, man. Don't let the things out there that um, destroy your destroy your um, your blood cells will make you look like you be 50 plus, 45 plus years old like me, and you'll be looking like somebody's great great grandmama or someone's great great granddaddy because you didn't take care of yourself. Take care of yourself now, man. It'll last a lifetime, dude. You know what I'm saying? Right? <laughs> <laughs> I just want to give y'all a quick shout out on that one, man. <laughs> oh, man. He did. He did get time, though. <laughs> we was wondering where you went, man. Aviation was, uh, I mean, Arkin, Arkin was wondering. Where the heck you went to, man? I kind of figured, uh, she probably slapped your hands <laughs> too, man. Ooh, y'all keep messing with her. Y'all keep on messing with her. I'll be landing in the aircraft wondering, man, man, y'all left a long time ago. Nah, man, um, the bot, man, the bot told y'all y'all had to go to bed because y'all were acting up too much. <laughs> That's funny. Keep messing with, don't mess with her too much, man. Don't, don't mess with it too much. I tell you one thing. I tell you one thing though. For real, for real, dude, man, that bot's been a savior for me, man. It, it has, dude. I get some people on here, man, that go crazy. I mean, they go crazy, man. We got loonies out here in this world, dude. You got people come on your stream, man. They, they like, they go crazy, man. I sit back and watch, man. Just, just, just let, just let the, uh, just let the bot just give them a good spanking, dude. I ain't got to worry about it. <laughs> you know? Oh, man. All good stuff, though, man. All good stuff, man. So, welcome back. Welcome back there, uh, aviation man. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh yeah, man. All that plus, man. Just yeah, we don't, we don't, and yeah, we keep it, we keep it clean, keep it clean on this channel, man. You know, without the crazies, man. Uh, I don't have time for crazies, man. I don't have time for crazies, bro. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Somebody about to get it. I saw that too. Somebody about to get it. I think that was Arkin. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> uh. But we saw it, though. We saw it. You ain't apologize to me. Hey, I, I, I'm sitting here just being entertained, dude. You ain't apologize to me. I'm good. 
<laughs> oh man, too funny, man. Again, you said you subscribed and you liked. Oh man, it's much appreciated, man. Much appreciated, man. Glad to have you all on board with us now, man. Officially, I will say officially on board with us now, right? Uh, part of the city itself, part of the squad now, man. Thanks for the subscription, man. Welcome, 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 welcome. Yep, you're gonna have a great time, man, with us, man. We can do some crazy stuff, man, as far as, like, things I try to plan for, man. Um, and I'll be launching some crazy stuff at times, too, so you never know what's going to be around the corner that you're going to see fly up, man. But, uh, yeah, man, we have a lot of fun here, man. Glad you're on board there, bro. Who's the worst person you met? Oh, man, the worst person I met? I'm not going to name drop, but they got punished pretty bad on here, man. They got barred, man. They got reported, so. Yeah, and we, got, we got some people who just don't, you know, they're, they're not pleasant, man. And, you know, not name dropping, but, you know. Uh, be, being, a, being, a, being a streamer, being a streamer, man, we have uh, options to submit people to get barred along with um, complained on. If they can complain on enough, man, it's going to, um, that'll follow them, you know. They'll follow them. And it, it can affect me as well on YouTube, man. So, but I hate to have to go to that level. But some people, man, they, you know, they, they, you know, they bring it on themselves, dude. And uh, and um, try not to ever go that route. But when you have to go that route, man, it's um, you have to let them have it, dude. And um, some people are very deserving of it, man. And it's unfortunate I did have. You know, I ain't gonna, like I said, I'm not gonna name drop, but yeah, man, I had, had experience on that, man, and that person has never been able to join the channel again, man. It's unfortunate, they've never been able to join the channel again. And I'm, I'm sure it's affecting them on other channels as well, too, but you gotta be careful, man. You know? Ah, not gonna go on details on why. I'm not gonna explain that one, dude. But it just got messy. Got real messy. Got real messy. We don't have to get into those, into those details, right? But. Things that are really messy here, and, and this is not the place for that, right? On uh, um, Nightbot, Nightbot takes care of the swearing, cuss words, and all that. And that's all captured, tracked, and all that. Um, yeah, the swearing, all that, is kind of minor, and he went uh, above and beyond that, man. So, yeah, that's cool, man. Thanks, Arkin. Appreciate that, man. <laughs> he said fudge. <laughs> exactly. We got some, some weather. Zoom in. A little bit of weather there on the radar, huh? Let me look and see uh, what kind of weather is that ahead of us here. One second. Wind bar, get weather, radar up. Uh, it's not giving us, it's not giving us um, live weather tracking. It's cutting off the weather track in certain areas. You see that? It's kind of weird. We got a little something ahead of us though, so it's not relying on the on our charts. It's not giving us there, but we do see something on radar here. 
What do you say? What do we say? Aviation. Say aviation. I love your streams unless there's a, a stream at like 12 o'clock or midnight. <laughs> I know, man. Being in different parts of the world, man, it's kind of tough. You know what I'm saying? I get it, brother. I get it, brother. I get it, man. I get it, man. Uh oh. Uh oh. One. One. What's up, Juan? Welcome there, Ron. Rich, I see ya. 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 Welcome aboard there, man. Welcome aboard there, Juan. I think Arkin got spanked by Nightbot. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, she, she punished him, bruh. Oh man, Nightbot punished Archon. Oh man, you see what I'm saying? Told you she's not gonna give, man. She don't, she don't, she don't play, dude. We're gonna cut center fuel. We're gonna cut center fuel pumps off. Cause we're finish using that fuel in the center pumps. Yeah, you got time out, dog. <laughs> oh, forgive me for laughing, man. It is what it is. <laughs> Damn, I gotta, we gotta watch this system, whatever the system is, man. We cross over, um, as, as we pass over Elser, we cross, um, November 50, West 050. Got some strange weather there, man. Got some strange weather there. <laughs> oh. Snap. So Amsterdam weather, man. I don't know what Amsterdam weather look like, dude. Um, let me just put up here and see what we got. E H A M, right? Mm. Uh, when you see like wind gusts and all that, it's something to uh take attention to. But here's the weather right now and um and uh Amsterdam here, huh? So anyone knows how to read the ATIS, huh? If not, then we'll, we'll go through quick lessons real quick. Uh, how to read ATIS. Alright, how to read ATIS. There we go. How to read ATIS. Let me break it down for y'all. So I'm not wrong here. Alright? Understand it, decoding the meters, ATIS, right? All right, let's talk about this here, man. Let's see. All right, come on. Decoding the meters. Um, all right, so y'all, y'all know, y'all know. Like, I mean, I am. I don't. It's not school time, right? So we're not doing all that. Dude. But let's just talk about that little blippet right there. Our ATIS, right? You wonder what the heck is an ATIS, man? All right, so you all know that's um that's our airport right there. That's um Amsterdam, right? Everybody knows that's Amsterdam. And what is this right here? That's the exact Zulu time right now that we're talking about. Oh, 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 oh. hold on, what I do? What I do here? Oh, what is all this? All right, delete all that. Oh, all right, cool. All right, so next thing is the time, right? Um, that's the time, the month, hold up, the month, hold up, what's this? This one, da da da, case, uh, 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 all right, wind, all right, reported wind speed, all right, that's the wind speed right there, three knots, that's just the time right there, right, right after that's 360 knots, and 300, the degrees, 360 degrees, the wind is 
traveling at three knots, right? Got it. You kind of kind of figure out what the, what airport you're gonna land at at that point, right? This is the clouds right here, man. Um, um, showing. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see if we break that down here real quick here. Um, one second here. So it's the variable clouds at 32,000 feet. Actually, what's the 40? And it, I said degrees of 40, 40? That's not, that's not degrees, is it? Yeah, that's the point of, point of degrees there, Celsius. And 999, what is that? Um, the Billabar? I don't know. Uh, few, few clouds at, a few clouds at 1,300 feet. Um, there's a few more clouds at, this is 2,500 CV, whatever. Scattered clouds at 4,500 feet. Temperature, oh, here it is, uh, 11 degrees. That's the that's temperature right there, Celsius. All right, QNH 0994. What's that last one? There? I think these are our arrival points here. Let me see. Oh no, I know. That's not a rival point. I don't know what. Rashira and Nasik? I don't know. Alright, so I'm close enough. I'm close enough. Folks, I understand the main points of that ATIS, right? What airline should I fly in the A33900? Neo. Yo, check it out. Check it out, man. Um, I'm a sh I don't know if I showed, I showed this yesterday, I think, but let me show you this again to help you out with that. Go to fly to where? There you go. There you go. Go to fly to where? Right? Go to fly to where? Click on Click on Browse by aircraft type. Alright. You have a lot of options right here, brother. Go find the aircraft. Airbus 330. There you go. We got Airbus 330 300. Um 300, 200, 330, 900. Click on that. Here's all your options for what's to fly that's being flown right now in the real world. All these airports, brother. A lot of options to choose from here, huh? See what you got there? A lot of flights to choose from. Real live flights to choose from, right? Have fun with that, man. Let me know what you decide. Check it out. Let me know. Let me know. Yeah, man, I use that. You're welcome, brother. Hey, man, I use that like every day, man. Every, well, not every day. Well, every, mo most times when I'm streaming, bro, I'm on Flight Finder, yo. 
and I'm like, hey, look, let me make some, you get, get some ideas here where I want to go with this aircraft, right? And make it happen, dude. It actually, believe it or not, man, a lot of people be trying to figure that out, man. But that right there takes you right to those actual flights and locations that we can choose from, you know what I mean? So I'm glad that was helpful, man. Hey, let's do our cinematic view, y'all. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna play that drone a little bit here. Let me get our drone up. Get a nice cinematic view. Look at a nice view here, y'all. With that drone. We haven't had our drone up yet, yo. We've been neglecting our drone, man. Let's zoom in a little bit here. And let's get us a nice, nice position for our drone, y'all. With this. Remarkable aircraft here, that Dreamliner. Huh? She looks good, don't she? Here we go. Yeah, man. Uh -huh, what do you say? It's cool. I'm glad I can make you entertain. <laughs> of course, man. I think that's a cool shot right there, huh? Gotta whip our drone out a little bit sometimes, right? Let's uh let's get on the other side with the sun shining. Let's get on the other side here. I ain't gonna lie, man. That's uh that's a good shot right there. You know? Oh, somebody said they about to go live soon, huh? Is that true aviation? Oh man. Arkin. Arkin's been let out of jail. He pulls the bail and he's out of jail. What's up? Arkin's back. They released him on the good behavior. Arkin's back, man. They released him on good behavior. He got bailed to get out of jail. What's up, man? Welcome back to Arkin. Oh man, hold on. What happened there? Oh damn. She gave him 10 more minutes, man. Holy smokes. She just dropped 10 more minutes on Arkin. Man, she's not gonna budge. She just gave Arkin 10 more minutes, man. Whoa, Jack. Whoa, Jack. Brother, man. Damn, man. I know, man. Like, holy cow, bro. Ooh. Man, you best for fire, brother. The nightbot, man. She, she's gonna. Yeah, you can't, you can't, you can't win with her, brother. She's always gonna win, yo. Man, she gave you ten minutes, dog. I know you can hear us, man. We're thinking about you, Arkin. Man, make sure you, while you locked up there, man. Um, you know the peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are pretty good, man. You know what I'm saying? Those um, nice soft loaf of bread. Um, peanut butter jelly sandwiches are good. Get some chips. Kool-Aid, whatever, man. Oh, yeah. You're not going to be locked up for too long, man. They're going to release you here soon, man. Oh, we'll be waiting for you there, brother. <laughs> God, dog it, bro. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, my goodness, bro. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, 
it out, man. Yeah, we just started across this Atlantic too, man. We're just getting out here in this Atlantic, man. That says that area that we see right now with all these cloud coverage, man. That's that whatever that storm system is, that storm cloud system that we're going through right now. Um, that we see on our radar too. Oh wow, look at look at it, man. It's pretty it's pretty crazy though, actually. Look at that. Dang, we're stretching out a hundred, like a hundred. We got 180 miles out, man, of this system here that we're, that we're, that we're dealing with. Now. See that? 180 miles out, man. That's a pretty big system right there. So we're going to get through it. All right, man. He says, see ya. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> What is up, Flight Sim? What is up, Flight Sim? Already you back. Welcome back there, brother. Man, Nightbot, man, is timing people out. Ten minutes here, ten minutes there. We lost Aviation Lover for ten minutes. We lost Arkham, Arkham for ten minutes. I try to warn him. You know Nightbot, man. She'll slap your hands, man. You push that button. Welcome back to Flight Sim. It's like you're the, uh, you're the only one that's not locked up right now. <laughs> Welcome back, man. How long we left on the flight? We have approximately we have four hours and twenty minutes. We'll be in Amsterdam. Four hours and twenty minutes, and we'll be at our destination in Amsterdam, man.
said flight seven. You said uh, I'm doing eleven hour flight. We're gonna triple seven, Frankfurt to Dallas. How far? How how far are you into that flight already? Like how much further you have before you get to uh, Dallas, man? By the way, that's also that's a good flight, dude. Great aircraft too, brother. Where are you flying that on? Uh, are you on X plane or what? Hey, where did you get the triple seven? Is that from um um what's that the uh, Captain Sim? Is that who who makes that who made that triple seven? Is that Captain Sim or something like that? Yeah, you got it from Marketplace, Captain Sim. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, man. Oh, I just heard. Man, the only reason why I didn't get it, man, is because I just heard that the reviews were not that great, bro. Captain Sim. Yeah, Captain Sim, man, it's been not been getting much credit lately, dude. So, uh, man. That's, uh, hey, man. Oh, they let him out of jail. What's up, Arkin? They like, give you a release. You're back, brother. You're back, man. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Are you good? You okay or what? You straight? <laughs> There's a heat wave, yeah. There's a party in the streets and the city's on fire. Okay, flight seven. You say it's a good aircraft. Yeah, Arkin, man. Welcome back to Arkin. Welcome back, man. Flight seven said, my game, my game crashed after we started. Oh, no. How often does that happen to you, brother? Does that happen often or what? Atlantic now um, we're heading out of ways a little bit as you can see just kind of stuck our nose out there a little bit we're, we're just now getting out there into Atlantic with uh, four hours and 19 minutes before we uh, arrive in Amsterdam
Welcome back, bro. Welcome back. So you gotta go to Easter thing. Why not, brother? Um, hey, man. Hey, listen. Aviation was good having you, man. Go take care of that, man. And go enjoy that, man. Have fun. Thanks for coming through, bro. Oh, flight. You got like nine hours left, man. Wow, you're gonna be up. You're gonna be up like five hours past. Past our arrival, actually, he's still gonna be up, man, for some while, for some time, man. Yeah, like, it pretty much got that fight just started. Got it. You did? Oh uh, wow, when did that happen? Was that was that today? Welcome aboard there, hello. Welcome aboard. How long is it till we get to Amsterdam? Well, take this much. We started off with eight hours. We're down to four hours and 13 minutes left before we arrive. And we're currently located, as you see right now, getting into the Atlantic Ocean now. Let's get out there. All right. I got a better map for you, though. I got a better map. Better map for you. This map right here looks a little better for you. One second. Here. All right. This one's much better. All right. There we go. There we go. There we go. There's our journey coming across the pond. About four hours left. Not that far to go. Smash down in Amsterdam before we know it. Hello, welcome aboard. Nice having you. Some nice stormy weather in Dallas, huh? Um, in a sim, and now, now taking off the cool man. Hey, listen, man, those are the best, those are the best times right there, man. Flying through the storms, dude. I love flying through the storms, man. I love flying through the storms, man. Ella, 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 we're going to board, Ella. General question, I just want to ask. All right, do you, do you fly on a flight sim or no? I'm just wondering. Not putting you out there. Most most folks aren't, are not flying on flight simulators. Most aren't. We got a few that are, so I'm just checking to see if you're a flight simmer as well, too. Um... Uh, Flight Simulator, you said I can hardly see anything. The visibility is bad. Oh, the 
stick that autopilot on, man. Make sure you have um, anti-ice going so that, that things don't ice up on you as you get through all that. And press on through, get through, get through those clouds, man. got a step climb ahead of us huh step climb at uh, north 51 west 020 got a step climb there we'll see what we're going to step up to once we cross that as a matter of fact we can check now actually right, we're going to step up to out to 410 at denim 410 at denim cool All right, so your initial cruise out to their flight sim is going to be 37,000. Um, throughout your cruise, it's going to be step climbs for you as well, too. Step climbs throughout your flight to any other altitudes. Thing, but still, 
kind of internet. Oh man, yo, that's cool, bro. Since you still, you still got internet, man. You got the you still cool, 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 cool. I mean, you can stay, um, stay present. You know, um, gotta give your attention to the uh, surrounding guests there, of course. But we're gonna be here. We're gonna be here. We are going to be here. Said I put something in general chat or Discord server. Yeah, let me check it out, man. Check it out. Huh. I see you drop a wave there. That's what's up, man. Oh, that was yesterday. Hold on. In general, huh? I just wanna be remembered. Now you're tired of talking so good. Oh, yeah. I just wanna be with you right now. You get your soul. I got it. Oh, yo. Yo, that's. Hey, man, let me. I'm gonna show this, man. I gotta put this. I gotta put this out there and show this, man. I started off from yesterday, man. You seen a couple things. You seen one yesterday, man. I want to put this out there real quick. That is a great photo, man. From yesterday. That photo is incredible, man. I like it, dude. That that's a that's a outstanding photo, dude. Wow. Let's see what else you have here, man. Well, you got a oh, that's a nice rainbow too, man. You got rainbow the first one. And rainbow on the second one too. That's a double rainbow actually. It's two rainbows. Oh man, beautiful capture, man. Oh yeah, man. That's rare. Wow. That's all I can say is wow, man. Damn. See what else we have here. We have. Oh, we got a couple more from you today. Ooh, we see you coming up through those clouds out of Dallas. Good capture there, bro. Coming through them, aren't you? Coming through it. Ooh. Got the KLM triple seven. She looks good, man. Looks good, dude. Good looking flight, bro. Looks real good, man. Oh, you got one more. Oh, you almost had crews out too on this one. Well, if you get up there, oh man, that's 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 a nice look, bro. That's how, that's how, that triple seven looks good actually. Yeah, triple seven looks good, man. The scenery looks amazing. Yo, for real, thanks for sharing these photos, man. Thanks for sharing those photos, there, Flight Sam. Arcaron, what's up, man? You're back, huh? Are you still being punished by Nightbot? Still playing around with her? Uh, like she said, bro. Yeah, she says it too. I can do this all day, what she says. Oh, 
sight to me. I done cracked the code, yeah, I'm a hacker now. Hacker now. Gotta let them see it, I went back around. back around. I don't need your wifey, she a pass around. She a they don't need to know it when I'm back in town. Tell them stop. Bank teller greet me by my first name. Hey there. Seen it shots, but got the worst aim. <laughs> Seen him out here looking like he hate cash. He hate cash. Treat that little like a face mask. They don't want no problems, they don't want equations We keep that same energy on all occasions More life to my enemies, won't stop the vision But I do not compromise with competition All my be sounding like it look like These be rapping for them book likes Alkaline charge like a battery How they got the minutes to be mad at me Pollen paper got them talking nice to me Oh man, are you serious, dude? Man, she put you away for 20 minutes, dog. Man, what did you do, bro? You said you have a PS5. Man, what did you do to Nightbot, dude? Man, that's uh, that's that's serious right there. Okay, you said it, and uh, hold up. You said if I have, if I got an Xbox, I would have Microsoft Sim. Yeah, well, uh, this is, um, as you're aware, man, I took the option to put on PC instead of Xbox. That's how I'm uh, pushing my streams, pushing my content is through uh, PC, not Xbox. But a lot of people do use Xbox, but not me, man. I used to I'd rather go buy a PC specifically with us. Simming, man. Ah, finally. Finally, 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 that flight sim. Kind of like you was there already. Well, you was making your way up to it. Those clouds you was left behind you there, man. You was climbing that altitude nicely, dude. That was a good climb you had on that photo, dude. Seriously, man. But you made, made that, that cruise out to now, man. Cruise there until you get to your next step, step, step climb. Climb a little further once you get a little further into your flight. Beautiful, 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 man. Right on, man. Arkin said, um, love you, man. You really make my happy. Oh man, that's cool, bruh. Every day because of your stream. Man, that's cool if you are kidding to say that, bruh. That's 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 thoughtful, man. Really appreciate that, dude. Really appreciate that, man. Really appreciate that, bruh. That's cool, man. Yeah, man, that's nice of you, brother. Um, flight sim. Flight sim, I'll put, I'll put one more on the. Oh, yeah, let's check it out, man. Let's see what you got here, man. Let's see what you got there. Oh! Here, look at here, look at here. Look at that. She's floating now, ain't she? Ha! Huh. She looks good, man. Looks real good, bro. She's floating now. <laughs> nice. Nice, 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 nice. I love it.
Oh yeah, absolutely. I will say so for sure. Can we add, man? It's a good day, man. I decided to launch this stream for you all on Easter too, man. Look at this, crazy, man. I thought I thought about just getting out there, get this content, man. What's good company with you guys, man? On Easter day, weather just keep it safe, man. Stay indoors, just chill a little bit. You know, work on my hobby. Collaborate with some good folks such as yourselves, man. Let's say for a better way can you do that, man, right? Yeah, to make uh, make it worse, I can get much because I'm on mobile. Oh, okay, 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 okay. That's okay, though. You'll still be able to stream, You'll still be able to pull data, You'll still be able to view. It's all good, man. You can do a lot with mobile still, man. But you are very limited, of course. I understand. Smart, 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 smart. You don't have to be restricted to that seat. Sit there, right? You can be mobile with your, with your, um, with your mobile phone, or or your iPad, or whatever you're using, right? You don't have to be strapped down to no computer, right? You're good, man. Yeah, man. I, you know, I could say honestly. I'm able to get so much done with the PC, man. Than anything else, man. Just got so much more you can accomplish with the PC, man. To be honest with you. But I actually built mine from scratch, man. So I uh, got piece by piece until I had the, uh, I guess you say, best well-rounded system. I could, I guess you could say, right? I got my lunch with me. Hold up, there's some what? There's some chips and a grilled cheese sandwich. That's what's up, man. <laughs> you ready? You ready, bro? You ready? You ready, man? Hey Arkin, hey, I'll be honest with you, I started, I actually started my simming with X-Plane. And uh, it was perfect for me, man, coming out of the box, man, just learning how to do, everything I had to do, learn how to fly, man. It was all through X-Plane, man. Um, then I got a little taste of Microsoft Flight Sim, man. And uh, I got addicted to Microsoft, man, after that. What did you say there, Flight Sim? You said, yes, sir. Later. Later. You gonna have some pizza, man. Yeah, man, my dinner my dinner tonight is going to be something a little different, man. Um, I decided to go out and get some nice lamb chops, man. I'm going I'm to I'm do it really nice tonight on the stove, bro. Lamb chops. Oh, I might put them in the oven. Look at some how to, like, kind of... Season them up nicely, right? And put some love on those lamb chops, man. That's what I'm gonna do. Make those things right, man. They're gonna be right. Yeah, y'all can't. Yeah, y'all can't. Forget the strawberries. Yo. They got a lot of lot of chocolate dipped strawberries. I saw they selling they, they sell in that stores today too. The chocolate dipped strawberries. Ooh, but they they're a little pricey though, man. I saw like a uh, what was it? Um, a dozen. It was like a dozen of chocolate dipped strawberries at the store, but it was like thirty three dollars, man. Like thirty three bucks, man. Like 
thought that was pretty pricey, man. Thirty-three dollars for like a dozen of of chocolate dipped strawberries. I think that's pretty pricey, man. What do you, what do you think, man? I, I think it is, isn't it? Um, Arkin said, I don't know how much about the buttons in the front, so how will I fly if I don't have how can I stay? Hey, it's easy, bro. Look, check it out. So all these buttons, man, you see here, you just click on them, man. I click on all this stuff, dude. Like, I don't, I have a, I have a, I have a uh, module here on my desktop that I can use. It kind of looks like this, it has all this, but I don't use it much. But I can if I want to, but I'd rather just basically just click on things here, man. Like I use the mouse, and I click on everything, man. The mouse, that's all. But man, we, I got to fix this um, this system here, man. I don't know what's going on with my, it just reminded me about the, um, about the, um, our, uh, our comms here, man, it's not working. Our comms with the ATC, man. I gotta figure out why that is. There's something just very strange here, man. It's, uh, it's just not, um, it's just not working out like it should, man. Let me see one, let me do one, two, two decimal eight on this one here. Transfer that in. Okay, but that didn't do anything though, actually. So I want the second frequency here. Still nothing. Can I push, can I, can I, let me see. Can I actually push this? No, nah, that's not clickable. But I can turn that, but it's not clickable. Is there an on off switch or something here? I don't know, man. Would you say there, Flight? You said, um, already, y'all. I'll be back in like an hour. I'm going I'm to be doing some homework. Yeah, man. Knock that out, brother. We'll be here, man. We'll be here. I wonder if this probably was my problem. Because this was not turned up, y'all. Like this right here. It was turned down. The volume for VHF one. Maybe that was my issue here. Let's see this one here. Turn that up too. Maybe that was my issue. We'll see when they get back online here. Well, man, hey, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta spend some dollars on a PC too, man. Like, it doesn't even matter, dude. Like, whether you're on mobile or, or PC, you still gotta pay. Like, you still gotta pay for it, man. Yeah, you still gotta, still gotta, um, still gotta pay for it.
must have broken my heart and really torn it apart in another life in another life someone must have really fucked me up like caused my heart to stop in another life in another life otherwise i don't know why i keep coming back to this keep fighting all of it don't trust that there's love to give What's going on, Ark? Ark yeah. What's up, man? Is 
that? 65 bucks, man. Um, oh, that's, that is pretty pricey, man. And uh, keep in mind, though, um, I think it'd be more feasible if you have a, had a PC, to be honest with you, man. What's going on? What's up, Arkin? I get it, man. Yeah, I get it, bro. But just keep the uh, keep tabs on that, cause once you um once you uh once you get your PC, you just pull that pull that into your uh, computer at that point. You know, not the fight again. Touching all on me, catching all on me, getting all on me. 
girl be honest. 30,000 feet and we can leave the world behind us. Cause you keep it raw, I'ma hit it with no. Mama hit you with my soul, I'ma hit you with these goals. You should probably leave your phone, ain't no service where we go. But you can't be iffy, iffy, baby, tell me okay, where so you're let's take a look here. Alright, so Put your finger let's on look at, uh, do our calculation here. Sorry, I can't do it for more of that, so that's some things to tell. So get the... Oh, the fuck was shit. So it's like we're gonna be, um... Ah, uh, step climb's gonna be 883 miles. We'll get our step climb, which is gonna be a 2100. Let's move on. We should be... Plan to be in Amsterdam at 2241 Zulu. What time is it now? I gotta remember. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Um, where's our clock at, man? Where the heck is our clock? Hold on. Oh, so. 2141 Zulu. That's two hours. And that's only two hours. Hold up. We'll be in Amsterdam at 2241 Zulu. Okay. That makes sense. Three, three and a half hours. Right now it's 1915 Zulu. Three and a half hours. Three and a half hours and we'll be at our, our destination. Yeah, Vatsim is down, y'all. I don't know what a Vatsim is. It's just spinning like crazy. You
Last we just checked, we just looked at that. What was it? Um, we just looked at this a couple minutes ago. Here we did. Um, what was it, man? It's 1921. We're gonna be there. And 2241. Three hours. We got three hours. 1921. 1921. 22. Yep, three hours. Three hours before we get to where we need to be, which is gonna be an extra. Hours. Actually, three hours and twenty minutes. Actually, three hours and twenty minutes.
happening oh, I'm sorry Frank fish I'm sorry I'm gonna call you Frank that fish he's had a man he said this is my favorite said, this is my favorite Boeing huh so it's sad that uh, they don't make larger wings as um really small range well range is I think range is okay you know I think range is okay I mean we could have went we could have went a little further than where we are here today Probably could have went. Uh, yeah, we could definitely could have went from um, like uh, oh, say like from Virginia all the way to Switzerland. We could have made a flight like that with this one. Um, not too bad. But yeah, she's she's great aircraft, man. Great aircraft. Appreciate that fish, dude. Appreciate that, man. Thanks, bro. Okay, let's see if we can uh, log into um, to Oceanic. It's calling us here. Let me see if we can log in here. Stand by, folks. Let's give it a try here. Let's see, one three one decimal nine zero zero. Oh man, we can't even call them, folks. Oh man, this is rough, man. Let me see. What am I doing wrong here? One second. Let
test test. Let me see here. Hold on, folks. Do a quick test on that frequency real quick. Test one, two. Test test. Oh, they're not picking me up, man. Test test one, two. No, it's not even picking us up at all, actually. Oh. This is KLM 1976 Radio Check. This is KLS nineteen seventy nine radio check. KLM nineteen seventy nine Gander Radio. We hear you five by five. Oh man, good gracious, man! I've traveled halfway across Atlantic and I could never get in touch with air traffic control. Finally, someone can hear me. <laughs> no problem at all. KLM nineteen seventy nine Gander Radio confirms flight level and mock, please. Yes, sir. We had um, scale M nineteen seventy nine right now cruising at altitude three seven zero, and uh, cruising at Mach point eight four for nineteen seventy nine. Roger Gander Radio copies KLM nineteen seventy four flight level three seven zero Mach decimal eight four. Do you have SoCal on board? Uh, I didn't register for SoCal before I came on board. Uh, I just had so much difficulty coming on, so I apologize for that. No problem at all. Uh, KLM 1974 position reports are not required. May, uh, monitor this frequency, please. Coming out, we'll say stay on frequency. We'll monitor for KL, uh, KLM 1979. Coming. Folks, finally. Get the radio. Level 30. Okay, folks, it was not us. Sorry, Virgin 1 2 Echo, you say you had to leave in the cockpit. Hey, for, uh, for about three zero to four zero minutes, if that's okay. Yeah, it looks good to me. Just ro uh, report one back, please. We will report one back, Virgin One Two Echo. Thank you. Uh, who else was calling? Gander Radio Clipper Six Seven Level Three Zero Mach Eight Four.
Flipper six seven Shanwick radio confirm. Uh, flight level three zero zero Mach decimal eight four. Affirmative. That's correct. Flipper six seven. Clipper 67, Roger. Position reports are not required. Do you have cell call on board? Affirmative. Clicker, uh, Clipper 67. Channel Radio, um, World Express 807, position report. World Express 807, position reports are not required. Maintain this frequency. 807, Roger. Clipper 6-7, standby for cell call check. Again, radio FedEx 1908 on track, Alpha estimating 57 north and 30 west in 10 minutes. Flight level 300, Mach 0.78. Radio copies FedEx 1908, flight level 300, Mach decimal 78. Position reports are not required. Do you have cell call on board? That's a negative for FedEx 1908. FedEx 1908, Roger, monitor this frequency. Clipper 67, cell cow was not received negative. Clipper 67, confirm cell cow, Kilo, Lima, Alpha, Juliet. Virgin 117 Fox shot for uh, flight level 380. Virgin 117 Fox shot, Gander Radio, confirm Mach. Uh, Mach uh, decimal 89 for Virgin 117 Fox shot. Virgin 117 Fox shot, Gander Radio, copies flight level 380, Mach decimal 89er. Do you have cell call on board? A firm cell cow uh, on board for 117 Fox. Virgin 117 Fox, say cell call code. Cell cow, Hotel Sierra, Kilo, Romeo, Virgin 117 Fox. Get a radio copy, cell cow, Hotel Sierra, Kilo, Romeo, standby for cell call check. And Virgin 117 Fox, we have the cell car. Virgin 117 Fox, Roger. Position reports are not required. Maintain cell call watch. Order maintain. And uh, are we able uh, to be awake for the flight deck for 15 minutes or so? Yeah, that works. Uh, you got plenty of time, so just report one back. Roger, Wilco. Thanks very much. Virgin 117 Fox. Pink Gander, Clipper 67, affirmative Kilo Lima, Alpha Juliet, we request additional cell call check. 
Roger, Clipper 67, stand by for solid contact. Clipper 67, SoCal will check and receive. Clipper 67, Roger, position reports are not required, maintain SoCal watch. Arkin, Arkin. Ah, oh, man. Wow, man. She's really giving you a spanking, huh? Hey, uh, good news is, uh, you got back here and, um, we've made our connection with, um, Air Shock Patrol, Oceanic, actually. Um, come to find out, it was not us the whole time. It was not our aircraft the whole time. I had to totally reset, um, uh, V Pilot. So, yeah. Uh, we were good, man. His V pilot was not uh, had issues there. So we're good, and we are on with Oceanic. By the way, so welcome back, man. As far as our current position, folks, we have two hours and 45 minutes remaining uh, for our flight to Amsterdam. Two hours, 45 minutes. about right man yep almost there Nice, 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 nice. Does your friend have um? Does your friend have a flight sim on um on the Xbox there? See, I did not like the controls. I uh, feel you about getting a PC. Yeah, man, you gotta get, you gotta get the PC, man. You gotta get the PC so you can get your controllers, your modules, your yoke, your your your, your rudder pedals, and all the additional pieces to go with it, so you can step by step slowly build your simulator, man. Yeah, it's, it takes time. Get one piece at a time, man, so you make it complete. It takes time, though.
All right, so um, so uh, so Microsoft Flight Sim on PC. Um, the cost is um, let's see, the cost is. Let's look it up real quick, man. Let's look and see what that cost is, dude. It's um, let me see. I want to make sure I'm right when I uh, quote this. Here. Microsoft Flight Sim. For flight sim, there we go. Here we go. Microsoft flight sim's coming up. It's coming up now. Boom. Let's take a look at it. All right. So there it is. Um, how much is it these days? How much is it? Let's see. Ah, here we go. So it depends on the package, of course. As far as package you want to get for Microsoft Flight Sim on depends on the package that you want. Um, they got the standard package, deluxe package, premium package. <clears throat> now I of course got the premium package. I come with a lot more than the standard and deluxe. Um, if you want to buy it right now, it'll give you a price tag of here it comes. Alright, here's our price tag here. 59 bucks for the standard <clears throat> for standard one, 89 bucks for the deluxe, and 119 bucks for the premium edition. There, ah, uh, look what they have here. They got the Xbox modules for you and all that stuff, and the controls and all that. Yeah, I'm strictly PC, man. I'm strictly PC in it, man. Yeah, so there you go, man. Hope that helps, man. So, yeah, it's going to take time, man. It's not nothing that, you know, I would say, like, overnight you can just wobble. You just get it, man. But, yeah, you know, you got to gotta slowly build up to it, man. It just takes time, you know, patience and time, man. For now, I think you're doing, I think you're doing a great thing right now. And um, and uh, what, I, what I recommend is this. Um, continue studying as you're doing. Even as you're on with us right now, flying across the pond here, we're navigating. Sometimes we're talking certain lingo with flight, flight procedures and stuff like that. As long as you're listening, man, you're going to learn automatically. You know what I mean? It all comes second nature. So just attentive, you know, engaging and listening. It take goes a long ways, man. Um, you start. Radio, just curious. Have you received their log on for FedEx 1908? FedEx 1908. Are you speaking about uh, the CP DLC? One second. Hold on. Hey, FedEx 1908. We're just getting that uh, settled in here right now, so I, I'll uh, I'll be able to get on there in a sec for you. All right. Thank you. Yeah, man. Um, yeah, just keep keep hanging in there, man. Follow along listening paying attention automatically you're gonna start learning stuff dude without no effort so you're just gonna start learning dude this is what this is where <coughs> this 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 is most valuable than anything else man it's understanding what you're doing man more than getting the system to be honest with you but that's the that's the fun part that comes along right but if you get a system and, and you don't understand things you get on then it can get really frustrating because it's a lot of mistakes will be made and um, and uh, you know it just it just takes time this is like part of study right here by you being here right now this all this is like what your exposure now is like study time for you right for when you do start getting these pieces together um, you, you learn so much just by uh, being, being being here listening right so just keep that keep that mind frame thought of it man and just understand that this right here what you're doing right here it's got to give you credit so just just stay with it man all right um yeah man yeah absolutely no problem at all man it's uh it's, it's a lot to learn man but it's fun it's fun man we got a step climb coming up step climb you see we're about to pass coordinate november i'm saying north 51 west 30 we're about to uh and we're about to we got some funky weather i see in front of us too let's zoom in on that real quick here a little bit let's zoom in on that weather 
What do you get something coming up on us, huh? Like 80 miles out? Gender Oceanic American 205 plus. Yeah, it's that little batch of clouds right there. It's a little funky stuff ahead of us. It's not okay, though. But, uh, zoom back out here. Let's show you what I was talking about here. American 205, stand by for Ocean Clark. Step climb. SC. SC. Step climb right there. SC. That is our step climb to altitude. We're gonna step up to altitude. Um, let me see here. We're gonna step up to altitude 410 at that point. Request to climb to 410 is what we're gonna do at that point. Okay. So let's uh, keep on floating, and once we cross that, we're gonna request for a uh, climb to 410. Make it nice and hot. Sweet. American 205, I have your phone. Ready to copy. Ready to copy, American 205. Shamrock Radio clears American 205 to Chicago O'Hare via Pickle. Track Alpha. Uh, cross Pickle time. One nine or five two Zulu flight level three four zero lock decimal eight six. Clear to Chicago O'Hare via pickle track alpha cross pickle one nine or five two Zulu flight level three four zero mock decimal eight six American two zero five. TMI Niner 1. Feedback correct. Return to previous frequency call overhead. I'm going to get the uh, deluxe uh, with the yoke the PC at the end of like 2000 dollars for the PC 170 for the yoke and the total is and, remi and reminder this is for next year when it happens hey man that's excellent man hey listen that's your plan Stick with your plan. Stick with your plan, brother. And right now, do these things right now. What you're doing. <coughs> Excuse me. Do these things you're doing right now in preparation to um, adding to your plan there, man, right? So you're already working it, dude. Just keep it up, man. That's, that's, that's marvelous, man. That's wonderful, actually. Uh, confirm flight level 340 and mock decimal 86. Flight level 340, mock decimal 86, American 205. American 205, copy. Position reports are not required. Say cell call code if you have one. American 205, I am not uh, familiar with the cell call. 
Uh, American 205, looks like you do have one in your remarks. Uh, it basically is just so I can ping you. We can see if it works, if you want. Oh, here it is. Uh, HS-KR, American 205. Shamrock Radio copies, American 205, Cell Cal, Hotel Sierra, Kilo Romeo. Stand by for Cell Cal check. I see you said for now. Um, you said you'll learn throughout the year. Uh, throughout the year, yeah, man, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, that's exactly that's the right approach right there. Exactly how you just said it, man. Exactly. You know, when I first started out, man, I started, I started, I started a binder. I started printing out stuff and reading stuff and studying stuff and getting back on and watching streamers and kept kept adding printouts to my binder to kept reminding me of different things and kept reading that's i just self-studied man i totally self-studied just like that man i, I was that serious about this because i really love this man and I, and I really wanted to get here you know what i mean to where i'm at and it just took that me printing out papers and stuff to remind me of things put in my little note binder and kept watching streams and it helped me all along the path man totally that all paid off man you know what i mean just keep it up man keep that drive going man Cuando no contestaba, baby, acuérdate Que en esos días fríos te serví de abrigo Me mataste por dentro tú diciéndome Mejor amigo, mejor amigo Cuando no contestaba, baby, acuérdate Que yo sé que tu lágrima lloré contigo Me mataste por dentro tú diciéndome Mejor amigo, mejor amigo Llama a mi amigo todo lo que quiera Pero tú sabes que no me queda Good grades. Uh, I can give you random a routing across the ocean if you'd like. Plus but uh, you oh, might be able to find man, some more concord tracks right that really on. haven't changed can, since the last really one's issue, is my understanding. So okay. they okay. never really yeah. changed. So if you can find you said, them, you're uh, most likely uh, correct. That's right. That's but right, man. That's random right. Routing well, might be your best make it, option here. Just because I life personally you make certain flight levels I'm allowed to give you. So yeah, man. Outstanding, dude. Stay on top of that. Get those grades. Get those grades. Um, get those grades on point, man. And very important. Hear me out on this. Very important. Hi, friends. Four zero or four two zero. If you Remind want, your you can put together parents a few, uh, and your friends as far as what your passion is. Across the Atlantic, 
and those because when they be hear this, they know you're just not uh, just talking. Just do they really know it's your passion. Where they'll just fly they'll support you. Points instead of your parents draft, always will support you, man. Option. You got a passion for something. Let your parents know that, man. It's important. Remind them of that, man. Stick with your passion Runner, and always let folks know what your passion is, man. Stick with it. Very, very important, man. Version one one seven Foxtrot. Uh, we're back in the flight deck. Back with you. Version one one seven Foxtrot. Welcome back. Yeah, very much welcome, man. Those are, those, those are good those are good options man those are good hey man that there you go there you go football player or uh or um or pilot man Woo, you're starting much earlier than a lot of people man so imagine advantage you're gonna have when you get older right but mostly a pilot all the way right on man by having that thought right now like i said you're way ahead of a lot of people already a lot of people don't come up with that until like they're much, much older, man. But you're coming up with that now. That's in me. You're going to be way ahead of them, man. Hey, dude, keep your head right on that, man. Stay on it, man. Stay on that. You know? That's amazing.
family store. Let's see, we have we have two hours and twenty-four minutes before we touch ground. Oh yeah. Yeah, I uh, yeah, I can't. I, I actually won't be. I'll be really busy this week, so my next uh, just 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 keep an eye out for my uh, posting my schedule. Uh, I'm gonna post something probably during the day, morning flight, probably around probably Friday most likely. I'll do something in the morning. I think I might do something. Yeah, it'd be Friday morning. Saturday morning and Sunday morning. So yeah, we got some coming up this week, man. So yeah, let's look out for that. I'll be I'll send those schedules out. Just keep an eye out for it. Good afternoon, Island 175, inbound uh minimum at play level presentation. Ice 175, Shinrock Radio copies. Uh, flight level 370 and say mock. Ice 175, Shanwick Radio, say current mock. Sorry, can you repeat? Ice 175, Shanwick Radio, say current mock speed. Uh, current speed, uh, max 0.8. Ice 175, Shanwick Radio, copies mock 0.8. Position reports are not required. Do you have cell cal on board? Yeah, my cell code is Lima Hotel Bravo Kilo. Okay. Ice 175 Shamrock Radio copy cell cal Lima Hotel Bravo Kilo. Stand by for cell cal check. Roger, standing by.
No, I won't be doing the no, I won't be doing the flight until um until Friday. Um yeah, I just uh I am gonna be really busy this week, so uh, I'll make sure by Friday, um, at the latest, um, I'll be back up in the air. Um yeah, just keep eyes open, keep eye, eyes open on what's to come. for World Express 807. World Express 807, go ahead. Yeah, the 807 request out of cockpit for less than 5 minutes. Approved, report went back. 807. Crazy. 
Friday most likely will be a morning stream. Yeah, it'll probably be a morning stream. I'll, I'll check my schedule. My 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 schedule um my schedule works out. Um, yeah, it'll be a morning stream, but I, I want to plan for a morning stream. So let's see what my schedule looks like. But uh, keep keep eyes out for it. You'll see uh, something come down. You'll see uh, my posting as far as what I'm gonna be doing this week. And you'll see that come down probably. Uh, you'll probably see it tomorrow as far as scheduled flight for this week. So just keep eyes open for it. We are back. Go Express 807, welcome back. And Virgin 1 2 Echo, we are also back. Virgin 1 2 Echo, welcome back. Level 410. Shamrock 40 Delta confirm mock speed. Mock speed. 
Mark uh, 0.82, so I'm at 4 Delta. Shamrock 40 Delta, Shamrock Radio, copy, slide level 410, Mark decimal 82. Do you have cell towel on board? Let me double check, it's my first time flying this aircraft, so give me one minute. I believe I do, it's on the headwind A330. Shermark 40 Delta, uh, if you look, it typically is when you log on and you put in your, uh, your call sign, it typically would ask for if you want to put in a cell cal code. If you want to use one, I would recommend disconnecting and just reconnecting and typing it in and it should be fine, but uh, if you don't want to, it's fine. It just, you'll have to monitor this frequency, that's all. Uh, hey fam, do, um, do we just make up our own cell calories in the flight plan? You would, I'll put it in your flight plan for you, but uh, you would go in your remarks section. Just, uh, if you want to, you can disconnect and reconnect and next to your, depending on what client you're using, it should have a spot that says cell cal when you try to log on. And uh, you can just put in, uh, it's just four different letters, so you can put in whatever you want. Hey firm, okay, uh, we'll disconnect and uh, come back. For, uh, sorry, Mark, for another. Roger. Standard radio, I do believe you might have a cell cal. Can you try um, Alpha Foxtrot Dash Hotel Mike? For next night, you know. For next night, you know, you said Foxtrot Hotel, and uh, what was the second part? Uh, correction, Alpha Foxtrot Hotel Mike. Get a radio copy, FedEx 1908. Hey, absolutely, Alpha, man. Foxtrot, you got that first Hotel class, Mike. brother. Stand by for cell culture. It's wide open for you, man. You got it for the duration of this flight, man. You're good to go. No problem. Shamrock 40 Delta, we are back with Cell Cal Alpha Foxtrot Delta Kilo. Shamrock 40 Delta, Shamrock Radio copy Cell Cal Alpha Foxtrot Delta Kilo. And I'll get you a Cell Cal check in a moment. Hey firm, Shamrock 40 Delta. He received the cell cow that I can't know it. And also, is there an, any update on the CPDLC? FedEx 1908, Roger, maintain cell cow watch. And uh, yes, the CPDLC is now working, so you can use that if you like. Air from 420, uh, requesting clearance via track. Zero. Sierra Oscar, estimating last room at 2040 ETC, requested flight level 490 mark 2.02. FedEx 420, Shenwick Radio, clearance on request, standby.
Virgin 117 Foxtrot. Virgin 117 Foxtrot, leaving my airspace. Monitor Unicom 122.8. See you next time. I'll just switch you to Unicom 1228. Uh, thanks for the service this evening. Good night. Bye bye. Virgin 117 Foxtrot. See ya. France 420, Shamlock Radio, I have your clearance advice ready to copy. Ready to copy. Air France 420 is ready to copy. Air France 420, uh, all right, you are cleared. Uh, Gander Radio, or Shamlock Radio clears Air France 420 to JFK via Concord Track Sierra Oscar. Cross Sierra Oscar 15 West at flight level 450 or above. Maintain lock flight level 450 for flight level 600. Stand by. Is there any possibility that you can send the clearance to your chat? Get one for me. First time flying over to the Atlantic. No problem, Air France 420. Yeah, yeah you can expect that in the chat. Roger. Via Concord Track Sierra Oscar, cleared cross Sierra Oscar 15 West at flight level 460, maintain block flight level 460 to flight level 600 for Air France 420. Air France 420, read that correct. Return to previous frequency, call uh, Shanwick Radio overhead Sierra Oscar 15 West. Returning to, free, returning to previous frequency and so crossing intelligence into our ships.
Shanwick Radio, Shanwick Radio, United 984 with position report. United 984, passenger message. United 984, track alpha, past pickle, time 2030 Zulu, estimated 57 north, 20 west, time 2051 Zulu, next 5730 north. American uh, Shamrock Radio copies United 984 cross pickle that track alpha time 2032 Zulu estimating 57 north 020 west time 2051 Zulu 57 north 030 west next confirm flight level and mock uh, United 984 flight level 360 maintaining mock decimal 84 Shenwick Radio copies United 984, flight level 360, mock decimal 84. Position reports are not required. Do you have cell cal on board? Uh, we do have cell cal on board. United 984, Roger, stand by for cell cal check. United 984, cell cal received. United 984, Roger, maintain cell call launch. Shamwick Radio, Shamwick Radio, Speedbird, one, four, kilo. Speedbird, one, four, kilo, Shamwick Radio, faster message. Sorry about that. Speedbird 14 kilo. I didn't even see you there. You can monitor Unicom. We'll see you next time. We'll monitor Unicom and Speedbird 14 kilo. Thank you very much. Enjoy your Easter sign. You too. See ya. World Express 807, Gander Radio. World Express 807, heavy go ahead. World Express 807 over Rickle, monitor Unicom 122.8. See you next time. Oh, well, okay, we monitor Unicom 122.8. Thanks for controlling. Have a nice evening. Bye bye. See you later.
Shanwick, 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 4 zero, Delta. I was wondering if you could send us an ACAS um, just to see if I if CPDLC works on the D8 of this aircraft. Roger, Shamrock, 4 zero, Delta, standby. Antonov 976, Gander Radio, copies flight level 370, confirm mock speed. Hey, boom, so cruising at mock, decimal 83, Antonov 976, Antonov 976, Roger, Shenwick, uh, Gander Radio, confirms flight level 8, or er, correction 320, mock decimal 83. Do you have cell cow on board? Confirm flight level 320 and mark decimal 83. I believe we do have cell call. It's, it's Alpha Kilo Hotel Sierra. You can give it a try. Roger. Anthony, uh, uh, Niner 76, Gander Radio. Cell Cal Alpha Kilo Hotel Sierra, stand by for Cell Cal check. Shamrock, Shamrock, Shamrock 4 0 Delta, just to confirm, we have received a cross outboard. Shamrock 4 0 Delta. Shamrock 4 0 Delta, Roger, thank you. We confirm we did get the cell call at um, time. Camera, or uh, correction, Antonov, Niner, 76, Roger. Uh, you can maintain cell call watch and make position reports this frequency. Okay, no problem, thank you. Hey, Oish Oceanic, this is um, KLM 1979. Can we request climb from altitude 370 to 410? KLM 1979, Shanwick Radio, you said you want 410? Roger that, yes, affirmative 410, flight 89. KLM 1979, climb maintain, flight level 410. 410, 89, copy. Seven five Shanwick Radio. Here am I, it's one seven five. 
Ice175, you're leaving my airspace. Monitor Unicom. We'll see you next time. To Unicom, uh, thank you. Bye bye, Ice175. See ya. our position report really how much further we have to go when you're out of we have approximately mind, one hour and 48 minutes oh. before we touch the Yeah, we're hanging in there, man. We are making good progress. I think we really we've knocked out most of our trip already. Um, I can honestly say we uh, we're pretty much already there. Our last leg of the trip here. Um, we'll be in Amsterdam like really soon now, compared to how long it's taking us, <laughs> right? Come across. So we're already across 
the um, Atlantic. So we have a little bit more distance before we are over landfall here. Right? You can see the progress made here. Almost in Europe. Right on, go ahead and keep that man, it's all yours. Seven three seven requesting sent. Confirm easy seven three seven. Uh, say again, Tower. I believe you're outside my airspace. Copy. Uh, center EZ737. This is the nearest uh, center. Uh, EZ737, it may be, but uh, if you're not in my airspace, I can't control you. Uh, copy. Should I, so, should I just descend? Uh, I would go to Unicom, and then I'd begin your descent, yeah. Copy, going to Unicom. See? Yeah, I changed the time. I changed the time on this so we can actually have a visual on our, on our arrival here. So that everyone will be just flying in the dark. I changed the time so that uh, we can have a better visual, right? Because right now it'll be absolutely dark right now. So. Just a little adjustment there for the better.
Aeromexico flight's gonna be uh, the next flight we take. It's gonna be Aeromexico actually. Antonov Niner 76, Ganda Radio over Reichel, monitor Unicom 12280CF. Thank you very much, Mr. Services. Great to Unicom 122.8976. Super. So long. See ya. Shanwick Radio. I'll go ahead for 1979. KLM 1979 over Denim. Monitor Unicom 122.8 CF. Over Denim? What to do this morning, Nathan? France 420 Shamlock Radio, you on here? All right, folks, y'all heard that. So over then, we got to uh, monitor you call what to do this, but wait. Uh, after Mexico, right now, 313, radio Swiss. check. Yeah, we have like four, Fire, three, one, four three, or five Shamlock flights radio, we got to knock out for our Mexico schedule to finish that off. So we got to get that done. This is just an extra that we put in between. Those, that schedule, so we got to get back on schedule and get those flights done. We got four flights knocked out from Mexico. We got to get that done. So that's the next thing is uh, knock off all the Mexico schedules there. Not um, right see now, Denim. Free. See Denim, With Denim, you, Denim. IFR to Porto. Denim's right there. Oh, we got another stage climb? Really? Oh, the stage climb is to 410 after uh, Denim. Now the denim, we're going to go ahead and monitor what to do this way. So let's go ahead and stay on frequency here. Let me pull that map in so we can see that a little closer here. Cool. Rainer 313, uh, you're very far out of my airspace. Uh, you can go back to Unicom. Back into Unicom. Rainer 313, thanks. See ya.
Then every time I could call you mine FedEx 1980, thanks for the ATC, but do, we do have to go, so see ya. Alright, we'll see you around. Gander Radio, Gander Radio, United 988, request step climb to flight level 400. United 988, climb maintain flight level 400. Climb maintain flight level 400, United, uh, United 988. Pickle, whatever your uh, your entrance waypoint was, you were supposed to call me with the position report. But I, I, a lot of people will make that mistake, so not faulting you on it. Can you just uh, confirm your flight level and mock, please? Yeah, sorry, my bad. Flight level three for zero and mock is point eight four. Giant two zero four one. Shamanic radio copy is flight level three four zero mock. Decimal eight one, and you have cell call on board. Decimal eight four, and we do have cell call. Aircon four two zero is now entering airspace. Reference four two zero step by. Giant two zero four one. Can you say your cell call code, please? Golf Sewer, Echo Juliet. Shout out radio copy, Cell Cal, Golf Sierra, Echo Juliet, standby for Cell Cal check. Two zero four one cell call code sent report received. 
92041, cell code received. 92041, roger. Position reports are not required. Maintain cell call watch. Maintain cell call watch. 92041. Air France 420, Shamrock Radio. Air France 420, you're very far, uh, very far north of the uh, the initial waypoint to join the Concord tracks here, Oscar. Uh, what are your intentions? Uh, well, I'm flying on the Sierra Oscar track. Uh, Air France 420, if you don't mind me asking, where did you get your, uh, where did you find the information for the track? Well, I, I found the beginning waypoint, so it's, it's on the net, on Reddit form. Okay, Air France 420, Roger, Roger. um, let's see, what is your cruise going to be at today? Air France 420, would you mind just reading off to me the waypoints that you have planned? Uh, sure, it's not mine. Uh-huh. Amaru. Make it fire. Yeah, me no understand why you're not here with me. Let me take it over for you, girl. You've been now searching, searching the wrong place. On your mind, only place that I wanna be. You define what true beauty is all the way. So divine, God must took a long time. The waypoint, the first one was less level, the ending one was Kenda. Roger, Kaelin, or correction, or France 420, would you mind reading off to me each point uh, in your oceanic crossing? Hey, United nine or eight eight Yanner radio. Searching, 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 searching,
searching, searching, yeah. Searching, 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 searching. In the wrong place. Wrong place. Yeah. Go for United 988. United 988. I forgot if I did earlier, but. Uh, crossing U Messi, monitor Unicom 122.82. Crossing U Messi, monitor Unicom 122.82. Thanks for hopping on. Have a happy Christmas. Yeah, you too, Sam. Easy 737 requesting descent. Easy 737, you're still outside my airspace. Copy that. Clipper 67, Gander Radio. Clipper 6-7 Gander Radio. Gander Radio, Gander Radio, Clipper 6-7 entering cell call. Clipper 6-7 over Umesi, monitor Unicom 122.82. Passing Umesi will monitor Unicom, Gander 6-7, thanks for the help. See ya.
Virgin 1 2 Echo Shanwick Radio. Virgin 1 2 Echo, go ahead. Virgin 1 2 Echo. Virgin 1 2 Echo, you're leaving my airspace. Monitor Unicom, we'll see you next time. Over to Unicom 122.8, thank you so much for your ATC. We'll see you next time, Virgin 1 2 Echo. Have a good night. You too, see you later. Shamrock 1 Echo November, Roger. We're actually closing up here, but uh, for future reference, I don't think. Oh, you know what? Never mind. I did get a clearance from you. That's my mistake. But yeah, we're closing up here, so you can just stay on Unicom. Come the radio version 12, Romeo with you, flight level 350, north 48, west 040. Virgin 1 2 Echo. Er, was that Virgin 1 2 Echo? Virgin 1 2 Romeo. Ah, I got it. Virgin 1 2 Romeo, Gander. Radio, uh, we're actually closing up here, so you can stay on Unicom. Roger, back on Unicom, Virgin 12, Romeo, bye bye. See you later. All right, folks, let's go ahead and plan our arrival for Amsterdam. Let's see what the, um, what our winds are at Amsterdam. So we got our, um, our eight is here. All right, we're showing uh, Adis of, um, it shows us where uh, winds at uh, direction of 110 degrees, 04 knots. All right, we're going to go ahead and log off of, um, of um, Oceanic as well, too. Go over to one two two decimal eight. Air France four two zero Shannon Radio. All right, one two two decimal eight. We're on. All right. Let's look at our over right here. So we got one ten. Hmm. I might have to listen in on uh on the eight is frequency. Right now we're gonna go ahead and um. Take the runway which we already planned for him, which was runway 1A right. See right there, 1A right. We're going to play that now. Okay, so let's go ahead and. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, did you see that on the chart there? Runway 1A right is where we're planning for our ride. Okay. Right here. 1A right, folks. It's our rival. Okay. Almost the same. All right, and as far as for our arrival star, Lamso, arrival. Oh, 
Lamsaw Rival, one second, let's take a look at that as well. Lamsaw Rival, oh, I'm sorry, it won't be Lamsaw Rival, it'll be uh, Redfin, one Rival. Redfin, one Rival. Is that Redfin? All right, let's go on program for Redfin. Uh, let's see what she say there. Arkin, you can search it up. Yeah, I'll take a look at that, man. Okay, Ram Soul, let's uh, look at, uh, I mean, Redfin, I meant. Redfin. Redfin uh, 1 Alpha, that's it right there. Alright, alright, and say expect the runway 1-8 right for our rival. And our transition. Sugo. Sugo from our transition. Yeah, let's play let's look at our plan break out of that. Let's set our plan. Range it down a little bit. Let's step through our plan. Oh, one second, folks. One second. Alright, so let's step to our plan. There we go. Alright, step. Make sure it looks right. Walk right through this plan here. So the top of our descent. The red one right there. Sugo. Sugo then turns. Turns in for a little bit. And see a lot of activity there. Yeah. 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 Alright, Zubu. Zubu, all that stuff I see. Uh, nah. Nah, we're not, we're not gonna go for, we're gonna go from Zubu to. Our airport up. Let's look at our runway running right. Let's approach running right. Here we go. All right, running right. ILS right here. And should go direct to. Oh, Sugo. Actually, yo, this is right, though. It is right. That is actually correct. I don't like it, though, but it's, it shows that's the right route, man. Um, coming through Sogol like this, 110, 100, I'll show you on the map here, marker. The 111 degrees there. Um, and then, you turn. Gonna turn in at the tunnel vision when I go to AM four zero. We're gonna come to the airport, turn back two four zero, two four one, two four two, and then hit our our um, the steps are ILS. The runway what it right, capture a glide slope flat around there. That, uh, hmm. Okay, okay, okay. So that'll work. We're gonna catch our glide slope at uh, AM621. Okay, okay, okay. Let's zoom in our map a little more. Let's take a look at that a little closer here. Now let's see that, folks, real quick here. Let's zoom it in. 
Okay, so. Alright, so. Four one, two four two, Davis, and six two. We're gonna be at two thousand feet. M six, AM, AM six two two. We'll be at one three one zero. We're we're all set. We're good with that plan. We accept that. So it's fine. It is good as is. Take us off the plan. Put us back on map. We're gonna map back out. Perfect. All right, gotta map back out here. And also, let's uh, look at our um, let's look at our ILS frequency for runway 18 right. Make sure that's correct. Capture our localizer. Uh, we got 110 point desert. That's correct. Okay. Um, yeah, all that looks right. Frequency looks right. All right. We're all set to establish our ILS and everything for our runway approach. And in the meantime, as well, too, we're going to um, tune in 132.982 um, just so we can get the chatter to see if there's uh, the ATIS. Log into the ATIS to make sure that um, the approach is um, the correct approach based on winds, all right? Make sure that it doesn't change on us. So we're going to monitor 132, 132 decimal 980. We're transfer that in. All right, cool. One, 132.980 is being monitored as well. Cool. cool. We're good. Folks, we're good. We're all set for our arrival. We're Amsterdam at this point. So, all right, fellas, keep it floating. Keep it riding out. And, uh, we'll be home soon.
Okay, okay. What's up? I've been on a paper chase for months. I've been on a marathon for months. All in all, I can't just get enough fighting. No. What's up? I've been on a paper chase for months. I've been on a marathon for months. All in all, I can't just get enough fighting. No. You're a step to the money, that's a lay lay. Take advantage of my time to get a payday. I've been to myself, I've been out the way. If I'm not with the kids, it's me and Tay Tay. Spend a bag, get a bag, that's a routine. I go north, cross the border like some poutine. Growing up, I had hoop dreams, still be on the hoop scene. But I turn hoop dreams to hoop dreams. And look, we made it. Still doing more numbers than the ones who got famous. Hear what I'm saying? I could take it, cookie cut the system, and go bust it down yeah. and bake. Okay, okay. What's up? I've been on a paper chase for months. I've been on a marathon for months. All in all, I can't just get enough fight. No. What's up? I've been on a paper chase for months. I've been on a marathon for months. All in all, I can't just get enough fight. No. Not Shaq West, but I'm getting really rich. Not your favorite rapper, but I really make it. Soundtrack the world, got a mess of who is this. Soundtrack the world, this is really just some biz. And I stand on it I've been on myself Put some bands on it No days out Put the time in Who me? Take a break Didn't plan on it Take a loss And I'm not stressing it The money works for me When I invested it What you step in? Not what I'm stepping in I cannot be Dressing up the mannequin Okay, okay What's up? I've been on a paper chase For months I've been on a marathon For months All in all I can't just get enough Fight, no Whispers in my head What you gonna do? So take it, kid, away Toes down, I'ma ride with the gang My whole life I've been doing my thing Get that money, ain't no day Anything I do, I do for the gang Ten toes down, I'ma ride with the gang My whole life I've been doing my thing Get that money, ain't no day Anything I do, I do for the gang Anything I do, I do for the gang Took those L's and I took that play All money in, we ain't coppin' no change Chill like ice cool, cause a dead good day Only 
we coming. This is all we ever wanted. Go and stack it by the hundreds. This is all we ever wanted.
Te vamos a tirar una cumbia con carajo. Vale. Dale mi negrita, baby, baila. Ese cuerpito de tequila y playa. Que maíta en bikini soleata. Bien cabrón cuando baila rebajada. Ese bajo mueve tan chévere. Muy suelta con ritmo bien heavy. Tan prendida cuando me lo pida. Qué culazo cuando está encima. Man, welcome back there, man. Welcome back. Give you guys a position port as far as where we are. All right, so check it, check it, check it. We're all almost on that home stretch now. Our final arrival. We're gonna plan our um, star approach. That's Amsterdam. Be a red fin. Rival, red from one level. We have approximately approximately 41 minutes before we touch ground. It's your Amsterdam. So we're almost there, folks.
Más importante lo que siento, no que vayamos a hacer. Quiero de esos besos y con exceso que de ti tengo sé quiero tenerte. Quiero beber. Te lavo encima de tu cuerpo y lento a lento no vamos a conocer. Usa como somos, mami así en plural. Everything is gonna be okay, that's my lady. Tasha de Romana, again, and you're call me Mania. We on different continents, you know that my coach is set. Checking on my phone. Oh, you called again, can't on your phone call. You know I'm sick of playing games. You could hide your feelings, but you know that I've been seeking that. Yeah. Could have tried to my baby, could get no machine okay. again. Now my God, I'm out, but you only look at me how. Huh? You've been on my mind, drive me crazy, look at me now. I lose it when it comes to you. Yeah. 
무자를 보낼 때너 계속 모르는 척해 okay. I'm on my own but I got 20 things that I gotta say And I've been drowning in my thoughts daily 네 생각에 I lose and lose it when it comes to you yeah. Something about you that I'm so into uh. 늦었지 마 I gotta tell the truth 매일매일 생각나도 what you made me do yeah. My apologies 갑자기 마음이 가라 라라 Hit lottery come to me 지금 바로 We can speed on the streets with the Wario the Lambo 지금 머릿속에 네가 살아있는 게 up on the hill And I've been thinking about it I'm out of time with 99 problems Think about it yeah. 만약에 우리 지금부터 시작이라면 uh. You don't have to worry about a thing I'll show you how it's done yeah. I love it when it comes to you And there's nothing I can do
Traffic right now, 2452 lining up uh, runway 09 right, he took traffic. Okay. Okay. Heathrow traffic, Ryan and 2452 taking off runway 09 right. Heathrow traffic. Traffic into traffic, Kibana two four five two, um clear of runway zero nine right, future traffic.
Amsterdam traffic. This is KLM 1979 Heavy. Started uh, our initial descent from altitude 4100. Uh, descending out of the Redfin 1 Alpha Star. We'll be expecting runway 18 right for arrival right for 97.
since we was kids You taught me how to fringe kiss Now you so cold with your business But you still don't know what love is Love is more than feelings, it's choices Why are we so indecisive? All these years later, still the same Running, open cycle, but before it closes I want you to want me
Aviation man, welcome back there, brother. About to bring this bird in, man. What's happening, man? Got to have you, brother. Yeah, man, we just now, just now arrived into Amsterdam. And uh, we're about to bring this bird down, man. <laughs> you see me floating, right? Yeah, we're about to bring her in, man. We're about to bring her in now. Yeah, we're going to make this um this initial road approach, man. About to be lining up here here for the rival from Amsterdam via one one runway 1A right. So we're expecting to Amsterdam here. Yeah, man, we're here. Been a long trip, man. Been uh, what? Uh, six hours. About six and a half hours? No, no, no. It's been more than that. Like seven and a half hours, if I'm not mistaken. It's been a minute, man, but we're here. <laughs> Welcome. this as well too so I can rewind this arrival after we land so we can get a couple different views on our approach in that land fun feel day and night man that's what's up man took a nap and now i'm checking schedule for tomorrow's flight right on man right on what's your next destination man where are you headed to
stay in traffic. This is KLM 1979 Heavy. Colonel Final Approach, runway 1A right. Glass slope. Let's go and start bringing her home. Put our speeds down. Me, but you know, yeah, man, yeah, yeah, I heard that, bro. I heard that, man. Yeah, you don't got a choice in that matter, man. You know, with seniority, man, you know, I get it, man. I get it, I get it. All right, folks, let's bring her in. Bring her home. Yeah, we're gonna get a nice rewind so we can get a nice window view on arrival. And we're gonna get external view as well too when we rewind it after we land. better butt of that landing. Alright, we're gonna we gonna try to do our best on that. <laughs> Welcome Paula. Welcome boys. Got her down all in one piece. Got her all down in one piece, folks. Welcome to Amsterdam.
Yeah, I went ahead and shut it off like about 100 feet up. I went ahead and shut that off. That old throttle off like 100 feet up. I shut that thing off. Um, hey, let me get your advice on that one. Do you normally shut that off um, a little sooner than 100 feet? Or do you kind of like... Um, kind of just flow with it, man. Because I, cause I usually take off like around 100 feet, man. Well, folks, welcome. Folks, welcome to Amsterdam. Let me get bird taxi in here. Clay Paula, shoot your question. You have questions, even though I'm new. You the rest of us, man. I, I've been, I've been, I've been at this only for eight years, man. I ain't been at this that long. <laughs> what you got there, Paula? What you got for us? Exit runway one eight right to the left via fifty one. See, I have a C A three eight. What you got there? Said, yeah, it's really based on company SOPs. Yeah, it's no standard operating procedures, got it. You know, so as soon as we hit our minimal, okay, we go full manual in the case of go around. All oh, right, that man, I heard that. I heard that. Right, so so in yeah, your case, like what you're saying, like it all depends, right? It all depends, right? Oh, so can you fly from Munich to EDM? YPH, please, and Qantas. Okay, okay, okay. We can do that. We can do that. You guys sound like that's a good flight, actually. I haven't flown that one, but that sounds like a plan. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Do that. I can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let him take my soul. All right, boys, we're gonna taxi this bird to the terminal. Then we're gonna take her back up. Let's take a look at that uh, arrival. But he hit the fan when uh, I got via I landed via the external view, which is going to be pretty cool watching that external view. And also, I think external view is actually the best, really, I'll be honest with you. We're going to take a look at it, take it back up on that final approach, look at it from the, uh, from the passenger window there. I learned my right from wrong on a song. I let my heart bleed on my sleeve. I'm trying to write my wrongs. But right now, my wrongs ran through a check because it's hard to live off bread alone. Got a good capture on that record. Yeah, yeah, let me know. Cause it ain't the end of times yet. I don't know, but it's getting close. Yeah, I need my space to breathe. That's why I'm going in. ghost. I ain't trying to stay up on that wide road. Cause I can't let him take my soul. Hey, 387, nah, nah, keep in mind. Nah, 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 no. I fly super, so it may be oh, different from the soul. smaller body. Nah, 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 yeah, 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 you, you fly, you fly, you fly the big ones there. Nah, 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 no. That big 380. Oh, I can't let him take That's my soul. What's up, man? Well, I tell you, man, having the luxury to be behind that, being behind that, that wheel on that one, man, I tell you, well earned, man, <laughs> I salute you, brother, oh yeah, I salute you, brother, for real, man. People I'm saying, get what I'm painting. Gotta have you on the board, man. If I'm on the board, then we plan chess. If you on my way, you gon' need a vest. Act big, you might get stretched. All your gun talk, I ain't impressed. My 45 seen real traffic. That's Dallas, Texas. My little partner called a body four miles away. Hey, folks, by the way, I told him get about the car. I got something for you. That 12 gauge gave me a download. The fly tempo. We ain't on the same page. Amsterdam Airport. I just had to hand and purchase the this airport. Yeah, I downloaded it. I tested it out. Man, this airport looks really nice, y'all. In case if y'all interested in buying that uh, download for uh, Fly Tampa Amsterdam, you're going to see it when we arrive at the terminal. Now, this airport looks real. When I say real, she looks real. Uh, it looks real good. Y'all see, if we get to this, uh, this gate. 
looks real good, y'all. I can't let him take my soul. Yeah, Alright, let's go ahead and get her in here. said the reason why because YPPH is my home international airport in Perth Australia absolutely put that one on the list as a matter of fact what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna set a schedule for that one uh, so check it out look, look look at it on our schedule I'll get that posted I get that posted uh, tonight. I get that posted so you can see exactly where we're going to fly that. Uh, I'll be um, actually flying out of the area uh, tomorrow on business. But I'll be back on Friday. So we got some flights on Friday, Saturday. If that's a long haul, we'll go ahead and do that on Friday. I mean on Saturday. I mean Saturday morning, get up and I'm going to knock that one right on out. I think that's going to be a good flight for sure. Absolutely. Ground is the KLM 1979. Whiskey 13 cross the runway 18 center. On to Whiskey 5 for 1979. Alright, let's keep our taxiing, folks. Yeah, absolutely, no problem at all. Anytime. Please give me the link and I can look at the flight schedule. Sure, 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 sure. Um, hmm. If you look in the description, uh, you can either subscribe or you can just look in our description on, uh, on the channel name here and just lock it right in. And when you do that, um, I'm going to set that schedule. You should see something pop up on your YouTube as long as you subscribe. If you didn't subscribe, just keep looking at my channel come back to it you'll see uh, scheduled for uh, the Saturday so just look into the description look into the description you should see uh, my uh, page in the description for our channel and go ahead and save that lock that in oh yeah look we'll at that look we'll at it going for you just don't lose me make sure you track me find me we'll get it back up so you can see that right that post in the next hour or so we'll see that post for that flight that'll be cool on that Alright folks, ready to get this bird parked here. Yeah. I'm really excited to let y'all see this airport, man. When I say she's nice, she's nice, y'all. This thing looks absolutely authentic. Alright, we're gonna make a left-hand turn on Bravo, which is coming right up. I know it's a long taxi. I can't find a link. Yeah, well, let me let me park this bird. Let me get that over to you. Give me one second here. It's, um, it's the Clintons, the Clintons with two S's, but let me go ahead and paste that in uh, chat for you real quick. Give me a second here. Let's park this bird first. Right, drop that on there for you. Give me one second. Yeah, it's a long taxi, man. That's that 1-8 right, man. Amsterdam, man, that thing is crazy. We'll park it right up here. Trying to laugh when you were the one 
If anyone has that link, I'm seeing all my controls here. If anyone has uh, have my link, drop that in the um, drop that in the um, chat for Paula. That'd be appreciated. Um, if y'all don't have it handy, don't worry about it. Let me get to this gate. No, I'll put that on the chat for Paula. She just wants to beat me to the punch there. Help her out there. All right, how much further we have here? All right, here we go, right here. I'll take this right hand turn, turn the fit in. All right. Hey, y'all, ch check out check out how this airport's starting to pop, y'all. See what I meant? Yo, yeah, she looks nice. She looks real nice. Oh, to your mama, she a blessing. There's nothing that I would undo. Never hit CS snows on your own. Only wanna treat you right, never leave your side. Always on my mind, I memorize, fantasize, everything I do. She looks good, huh? God, that was a great flight, y'all. Uh, let's go ahead and get her back up here once um, I park. Drop that link in our chat, Paula, and then we get this bird back up in the air on our arrival so y'all can see from a different viewpoint. Good enough right there. Let's go ahead and, uh, ah, did we overshoot it? Nah, it's okay. We did a little bit. That's all good. Alright, folks, uh, stand by here real quick here. Let's put our brakes on. Alright, Paula, let's go ahead and get that over to you. Let's get that link over to you. Thanks for your patience there. Alright, let me see. One second here, Paula. Channel up here. One second. Okay. One second. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. All right. So, go ahead and drop this here. There you go, right there, Paula. She's going at, at you directly here, so you can get that. There you go. Go ahead and check me out right there. Got you in there in the chat there. Hey, folks, let's take this back up so we can do a, a quick rewind there and take it from a different viewpoint on this arrival, all right? So, let's see. Um, Spawn it back in. As a matter of fact, let's get off of that too, so we don't disturb them when we spawn. Alright, we just shut them off there. Cool. Alright, we're going to respawn here. Let's see. Give it three, two, one, and boom. Alright, let's go ahead and play that. Get that going. Let's get a little closer to the runway here, to the run arrival here. Let's get a, a different view here. Let's get it from, um, get a nice external view here. See, everything should be. Quite up as far as our flaps, all that should be operational. 
at least, I, at least I would hope so, right? All right, let's get an external shot here. Like I said, it's going to reset our drone. Get our drone in the right position. And let's pause it first before we get carried away here. Yeah, let's pause it first before we get carried away, huh? All right, it's locking in. Lock our drone in about right in here. Lock that drone in right here. And we're going to get a perfect shot for it, too. Lock that drone right there. All right. Back it off a little bit, back it off, back it off, back it off. Get a nice zoom in shot like right around here. It's gonna be cinematic here. Let's do it with that. That looks good right there. Let's go ahead and hit play and let's let it go ahead and float. All right, so this is gonna be a nice, a nice cinematic approach here. External, huh? Throw that in there for you all. And then we'll do a nice window. Sure, the flaps will come down automatically. It seems though this is a rewind, but they may. We'll see. If not, I'll force it. No voy negarte, no. La primera vez que tú me la hiciste, baby, quería matarme. Pero ahora no, ahora no. El problema fue amarte. Sabiendo que no sientes nada y no sabes qué. No sabes qué Esta mi despedida Vete con el que te hundía Suerte que ya no eres mía yo Ya no te aguanto, no Esta mi despedida Vete con el que te hundía Suerte que ya no eres mía yo Ya no te aguanto, no Lo peor es que Get her in. Hey, what's up, bud? What's up, Flight Sim? I see you there, man. Yeah, we already landed this bird, man. We're just gonna rewind on the capture.
bit. Slow down. There. Folks, let's take it back up one more time. I want to get a good runway approach on this as well. Set our drone. Let's rewind the tape. One more side shot here on the rewind. Get a pause for like right hand. Get a pause right. Get a pause right there. Cool. All right. What we we'll do is go ahead and get a lock on this bird here. Let's zoom in a little bit. Get a lock. Close lock up on her, like right in. I would say here, do the lock. In the back. You zoom in. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's swing around real quick here. Get her in a good position. And let's see, let's see how this looks here. Let's go and fly her by and see how she looks. Go ahead. Okay, okay, okay. Go with that. Go with that. Get back up. Sweet. Yeah, we'll go with that one. All right, let's go ahead and get her up and let's get a wing. Get a uh, wing through there and um, and runway capture all at the same time. Let's get her up. We reset those those flaps as well. Let's get her up a little bit more here. Right about and. Here, I think it'd be good. Cool, let's go ahead and press play. All right, all right, let's go ahead and reset these flaps here. All right. Now give me love. Okay. Now give me love. All right, I think we're all set now, though. Perfect.
All right, folks, thanks for watching. It's a pleasure having you all. It was a great stream. Great stream, great stream, folks. Hey, this is from Toronto to Amsterdam, folks. We'll see you on next round, folks. Have a happy Easter. Peace out here. Catch you on the rebound out here.